It is Friday night, my friends. It is Friday night happy hour. The milk stein is full and ready to go. Um, my backup sweet tea is here. Um, uh, yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm ready for tonight. This is this has been. It was a long, but at the end, ended up being a pretty okay week. Um, I think I think we all had long weeks in in our own respects. Um, but for the most part, things turned out okay in the end. Um, let's see. It's my three-month stream anniversary. I've been doing this for three months now. I have no idea that it's been that long. I mean, I kind of did because I put it on the calendar. But still, I can't really explain it. Like, I can't fathom it. This is this is this is this is wild. And and you people are all here for the ride. Um. So I appreciate that, um, but yeah. <sighs> it's okay. one of the many services you provide. That is one of the many services off, I provide. You people, listen, listen. A glass of water and thin mints. Oh, our box hasn't come in yet, but we just ordered ours a few days ago. So I'm sure it'll still be a couple days before we get our Girl Scout cookies, because um, tis the season and all that. Um, I forgot it was that season. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Listen, I'm just going to tell you now, Elena, if you're looking for Girl Scout cookies, Tom has the hookup. He knows somebody. Boy, does he know somebody. And let me tell you, she's extra cute because it's his younger niece. And just, yeah. If he has a link, he should put it in self-promotion. He... So I have excuses to buy, uh, to buy cookies. I think that sounds like a fantastic okay. idea. Cookie! Okay. Uh, all right, now that I'm done acting, I am lazy and need links. Well, I mean, links are helpful. Um, uh, let's see. Oh, I saved the town. I saved the world. Okay, if she. Ex hey, she hey, there, hey there, Mrs. She, Alabeth. You want to throw that link on in there for me? Hmm. Oh, I'd be so much obliged. So yeah, go ahead. If you want to throw the throw the link in chat too. Um, because yeah, that'd be that'd be great. Um, so yeah, oh, we got some stuff done in the realm this week. Um, I've been doing some stuff the last couple of days, and the crew really hasn't seen it yet. Um, we did have some test proof of concept stuff that we did the other day, which was fun. But I've cleaned it up considerably, and um, let's just get right into it, shall we? Ah, all right, let's see. Yeah, if she extended her, her, her goal, like it's, it has to be solely because, oh, hey, look, I came in and went straight to bed. That's typical me. Walk in the door, go to bed. Because uh, I bought a you, box truck worth of you, cookies. You literally bought every cookie that they had. Jesus Christ, I saw the box of cookies that you bought. And let me tell know, you. It's only four kinds. Uh, okay, but when you buy like 17 a piece of them. Five each. Sure, sure. That's, wh wh whatever you got to do to justify it, that's fine. But let me tell you, like... I mean, if you saw the picture, then either your counting is off or... I don't know how to count. Do I look like Count Von Count? No, I do not. I don't have... Well, I'm sure glad you're in charge of our inventory, then. I didn't say I know how to count it. I just know where it is. I don't know how much it is. I know where it is. Location and counts are two very different concepts. Yes, you do inventory counts, but location is completely different. You have to have the location, but those are two different poles. That's right. See, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, it wasn't actually it. Yeah, bear bear no count. It wasn't actually it wasn't actually seventeen boxes a piece, Swaggy. It was it was actually twenty boxes total, but still. It was many boxes of many cookies of tastiness of yum. Yes. We're probably closer to 19, that one's maybe Allie 18 by this point. <laughs> I might. Well, you yeah. did. You did. Battle, Battle Bots was on. Right, 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 right. I'm on, on, on how much I'm talking myself into this. 
Uncle Cookie oh. Tomster. Oh wow. If I if I may offer this counterpoint, Lana. Cookie. That's an excellent <laughs> point. Like he's kind of got you there. Point. He makes a riveting argument. <laughs> so you know, you can take that or leave it, but. I think there's I at think least very one type that Chris likes. I forget what Valid which argument, I think. I If I had to, to guess, I would say Lollipop is a shortbread person. Nice, simple, oh, no. classic buttery. Maybe? Maybe? I think he's a tagalongs person. Really? Mm. He does like him some Reese's. Well, that's that's true. Mm. It does It does have the peanuts and the butters. So, um... Follow me out here. Oh, that's our barn. That's our barn with the cow on the side. Why are you under it? Why am I under what? Under where? Under there. Ah. This is starting a movement. <laughs> yeah, that's our that's our barn. That's where we keep our our cows and chickens and pigs and and sheep. And llamas. And llamas. Just the one on the roof, though. Yeah, we keep the llamas uh, anywhere they show up. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. That's, that's where we keep the llamas. Like, not, not, not all of them. I might have murdered some over by the boat because I got tired of them. Some of them are... A strong word. I retired them, the Virtue Tomway. Oh. Oh, well, I'm proud of you. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> there, there is, in fact, a llama on the roof. That's where it lives now. It's just the way it is. Um, I did clean this up and add some more mossy stone brick here, so that's nice. Like, so we got that going for us. The makers of Fiddler on the roof. It's llama on the roof. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. So if you if you come out here from from like the main base where we have like the underwater entrance and the main entrance up top and all that stuff, we come out here to where this stops. Then this cliff now drops off, and it kind of staircases off down here. Uh, Cause there was a bunch of stuff here, and I cleaned it all up. And now there's a conduit here. Oh, hey, lollipop! Lollipop swimming around with that Hello. conduit power. That's that good conduit power. So we have a fully powered be a conduit. Shame if I smacked your conduit. Don't smack my conduit, and that would hurt. Bap. Don't do it. <laughs> you did not consent, Chris. I did not consent. Bap. You don't go smacking things that are not consented to being smacked. That's true. That's true. That's right. Listen to your wife, who is the primary person who provides or denies consent for you. <laughs> it depends. Sometimes, gonna, sometimes, sometimes, sometimes you don't, you know, whatever. Sometimes their consent is not given. But anyway, here's our fully powered conduit, which means... These little boogers right here, they take the damage slowly, but they still take it. And, but yeah, I cleared all of yeah, this out, and I cleared out like a couple of block space under the barn so we can walk under the barn or put stuff under here or whatever. But you know, it's a thing. So, because this conduit's fully we are, powered. We are a consent based server, Sydney. Yes, that's right. We are a. Listen to the beautiful mooing. Conduit power is haste, water breathing, and um, night vision. Night vision. Thank you. Yep. So it'll be nighttime in a few minutes, and we'll see that. So it extends from the extreme corner over here by the front. So like as soon as you get into the water by the main entrance, you get conduit extreme. power. Extreme. <laughs> then we can swim all the way over here. And we can get almost to where the walkway gets to the farm on the far end. So it it stops about here um, is about the extent of the conduit power. But, I mean, you can see how far that gets us. We can come back over this way. And, again, I cleaned up and cleaned out a little bit of the area around here just to give us a little extra room for activities. Conduit. And yeah, so and then we can come around this other side. This seem right. 
And we can almost get to Triabithia. Well, the, the bridge to Triabithia. Oop. Okay, back down here. Let's see how far we can get over here. It's actually five. That's have you seen your supplies, Tom? No, I haven't been over there and well like all. You should you should poke your head over there. I will in time. Fuck that guy. At the moment I'm very far away. Alright. I'm trying to get a count correct. So almost almost to the, the the far bridge over here. Oh, that's what I did. So yeah, we got we got some good conduit power going on here. It is the most good. Hey, what did I tell you? That, Quit it. That doesn't even make sense. <laughs> Spit it out. <laughs> That's what. <laughs> <laughs> That's his reply. That, use your use your words, you damn zombie. <laughs> hmm. 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 So yeah. So conduit power like most of the way around the uh, the walkway, which is pretty nice, honestly. Like we get we got a lot of reach here, which means we can do a lot underwater if we want to. Right. But yeah, we can we can dive all the way down here, way down here below the surface, and everything still looks good because because that that sweet sweet night vision. Your night vision. Your face is night vision. Face? Thanks. Dang. Get wrecked. Or whatever. So, yeah. Uh, I think that's how that goes. Let's see. So, there's something I want to test tonight. Um, I want to see if we can build... A round nether portal. Science! Science! Do we have any dun, 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 we need to to? Uh, no, I was just going to build a temporary one and then take it down. That's fair. Basically, I was just going to see if it would light. And if it does, great. If not, well, you know, we scienced. We, we did what we could. Round. round. Okay. There. Fire the missiles. All right, let's see. That's a sweet portal, you might say. Round. Um, oh, I need some. I need some crap blocks. Give me some crap. Got, got some crap over here. Oh yeah. So there's the four. Then I skip two. One. Oh man, how about them them Pokemans announcements today? Boy, Three? I. Although I'm still just most hyped for Pokemon Snap, so I mean honestly, like, like I'm already Snap like, looks really good. Like I just want Snap now. Please. Okay, thanks. Bye. What the fuck happened here? I've been wanting Snap for like ten years. I think it's been that long. I don't know. A lot of years. Uh that might be too big. If they had uh if they had picked Trico instead of um Instead of it for 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 the, the legends the legends game. Oh yeah, I would have been like, I have a mighty 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 need. Nine, Not you, you. don't like Rowlet, or you just don't like it as much. Uh, I much prefer like the the other two that they put in there were like my oh. some of my favorites out of the starters. I I do and, love me some Chikorita. Not gonna lie, Rowlet. It's one of my favorites. Cyndaquil is my favorite, and Piplup's pretty up there, so I'm pretty screwed. I'm, I'm need all of them. I mean, it's a sweet little penguin baby. Like, how can you not love the Piplup? I, mean, I think the only not... one they could have done better was if they put, like, what was his name? Poplimo? Oh, yeah, the seal? The, the seal, yeah. Just because he is fucking adorable. That doesn't make sense. Oh, he's, seal. he's pretty adorable. Colors? That makes sense. Oh, mm. sad panda. Well, maybe it just doesn't have enough blocks in it. And... No, it definitely does. No, I mean, like, maybe it's just right. like not like solid enough. Oh, I don't think that usually matters, but that's fair. 
So, Swaggy, we did go to the end um, for like a few minutes. Um, but then we didn't. Uh, Lollipop and I went. Yeah, we, we got to do that. I mean, we did the. Um... And for me, because I want more shulker boxes. We did do the hunt for shulker boxes on stream, so we that. We did. We we went and we did some of the. Uh, we did an an in city. Um, Sorry. You okay? Yes. She sneezed. I sneezed. Oh, okay. That's that's what I thought. <laughs> it sounded it I sounded very like a sneeze. But yeah, we need to go back because I oh. I want to try and hopefully find more shulker boxes. Yeah, me too. Because my goal in life is to have as many shulker boxes as I have end chest slots. Oh. End chest slots, that's the word. P Q R S T U V. Elemental P. I really want to start spouting random numbers at him, but I also don't want to be that mean. You can. It's just more time between you getting another level in this fucking trading hall. <laughs> That's fine. I'm. I'm. I don't remember why, but I was told to get back on my bullshit, so I am back on my bullshit. So then go throw um, fish at this asshole. Uh, I think she meant the diggy diggy hole bullshit and i think it's because redstone yeah uh, i don't remember why redstone though oh i think i'm gonna end up making because a bunch of redstone shit to put in the sword of matic at some point that right okay i think i don't know i just remember being told that you needed more redstone and so i'm in a hole digging that was the conversation we had i just do what i'm told okay i'm just here so i don't get fined i do what i'm told Six, seven. Okay. I'm also a big Dang. fan of the person that took the box art for the uh, the remake for Link's Awakening and put one of the main characters of the Sinnoh remake on it and slapped the Pokemon logo over top of the Legend of Zelda. <laughs> I mean, that's that's almost exactly what it is, and I'm not even mad about it. No, I'm here for it. I tell you, it looks nice. It looks really pretty. Five in. I don't need Pokemon games to like if that if that's the art style they need to go with to make it not look like. Oh my! What? Oh, it's oh, raining. That's the style they need to, if that's the yeah. art style they need to go with, so that I don't know, we can have all the Pokemon in the game. I'm, I'm game. That's the one thing that I'm curious yeah. about. Um, so, just so that we're all clear, um, I get conduit power from where I'm at. If it's raining, which I can see Zach from here. Dang. Yeah. Swaggy, that's what I was thinking, but like then it's like the portal. Like I want the actual portal itself to be round too, not just the frame. I was kind of hoping that we could, but we can't. Wrecked. Yeah, I guess I got to report back to Mo at some point and tell her. Google told me you could, but. Clearly, Google lied. Well, maybe Google was getting bad well, info that's what from. You get for trusting Google. That's also a good point. I mean, I didn't like severely trust it, but you know, it is a starting point of information. Yeah. I, for one, welcome my Google overlords. Bet you do. I so do. I know you do. We they decided to go Google. tyrannical on us. I am fucked. Oh They're yeah. Not quite. As micro as Google as you are Microsoft, but it's it's about as close as we get. Listen, if if I had to pick one, I mean, I think I picked the least evil of the group. Uh, the thing you didn't have to pick now, one. Now, but I did. Sure. Yeah, you chose to. 
Well, yeah, no, I know. Uncertain noises about least evil, but I mean, if I you mean, if you want to if if you oh, want to look at like here. the list, if we're talking between Wee. like Facebook, Apple, I guess maybe least. No, that's not my point. My point is you're not required to be brand loyal. You choose to be brand loyal. Well, yeah, no, I know. They're if... all evil. Like, every one of them. Well, that's why I said least evil. That's fair. That's the qualifier, you see. Uh, did he say least evil, or did he say at least evil? You're at least evil. At least they're evil. I see you over there. Yeast evil. Yeast evil? Like, like. What about weast evil? (laughs) I was thinking, like, you say yeast evil, and I think of like, I'm like, like plankton from SpongeBob. Probably. Oh, how the turntables! I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. SpongeBob and I aren't 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 on reference terms. I'm I'm not either. I am. I super am. That's right. Grass goes at the bottom now. That's just the way it is. That grass lives under that rock now. It's like surprise grass. Ah. What happened? Ah. Just conduit power is basically light mode for my face. Oh, hey. I just love that we get conduit power in the rain. Like, we're not submerged, but we're still moist. Moist. I don't know what we're going to do with this area down here, but I put it here, and it and it lives here now, so, you know. You can do anything you want. We've come to a power. That's true, we do. I can, I can stay down here as long as I want. What was that? That was a cough. Oh, well, don't do that. I hear All that's right. bad for you. Well, you're not coughing would probably be worse. Well, I mean, it depends on why you're coughing. If you didn't have to cough, it would probably be better to not cough. But if you needed to cough, it would not be good to not cough. I feel like you're trying to say something, but I'm not entirely sure the words. We'll tell you when you're older. Oh, okay. We'll tell you when you're... Yeah. I'm older than I'm I'm older than both you and Lollipop. Doesn't mean that you're old enough to be told. Take a seat, Junior. Damn. Oh my god. While I was out here the wolf farm was running. Holy shit. Good. Woo. We need to expand that into like eighteen million other colors. Oh son of a Well, bitch. I mean, there's only sixteen total. But sure. Okay, I said what I said. 18 million sheep producing 16 colors. I don't think we can I don't think we can have that many entities in the world. I think that is a limitation of the server and also well, the engine. Well, to be fair, what isn't the limitation of the server? Well, that's yeah, a good right. point. The entire server is a limitation of the server. Yeah, the server is a limitation of the server. So I'm thinking about I'm I'm thinking about getting us off of realms and going to a private server. Like the only person that would really have like a bit of a pain in the ass to set it up would be me cuz I'm on console and console doesn't by default give you the um the option to add a server like Windows 10 edition does. So I would have to like work around to add it on both Xboxes that I play it on. And on the switch. Oh, we have the shears in the dispenser, so it automatically shears the sheep. So what happens is there is here. I'll show you real quick, because that's our that's our wool farm. Well, I mean, yeah, we can have just one, but like, if we have nine in there, like we have we have all of those sheep. And so we have nine shears so that it lasts nine times as long. 
So we don't have to wait for the one shears to go bad. We can have nine shears that can go bad over a much longer period of time. Hey, I had a random ass thought. Go on. Does Can you put looting on shears? No, I've tried. You cannot put looting on shears. Can you put, can you put fortune on shears? No, you can't put fortune, fortune on shears. Fortune works for the breakables. Holy shit, that's tall. That stuff. For breakables? To do like ores and stuff. It doesn't work on like animals. Fortune does not work on animals. Uh, if I come kill a cow with my fortune pick, it's not gonna give you like several freezers full of beef. Right. Or like an entire truckload of leather. Right. Right. If that was the case, I would always be killing cows with fortune. Wow. I need all the leather. Many truckloads. I also need all the leather. I mean, isn't that what looting's for? Well. Well, yes, but if I was, I was mostly just trying to figure out if we put uh, if we put looting and or fortune on shears and put them all in the dispenser, would they would we increase the amount of wool we were getting? No, because you can't put looting on shears. Yes, I understand that now. But do you see? Mm, that's a good point. That's a good no, point. No, but he does A and B. If he wants to see, he has to go out to the boat. You're why we no, can't have nice see. things. We just need conduit power. Me? Yes. That's why we can't have nice uh -huh. things. Oh, we got the And now you've got Taylor Swift stuck in my head, thanks. That's not my fault. Ooh. Yes, it is, because... The, why we can't have nice things is a Taylor Swift song. It's also a phrase that's been around. I know, but it's also a Taylor Swift song that I've heard recently, so now it's stuck in my head, and it's your fault. Your face is a Taylor Swift song. <laughs> I wish my face was half Daughter. as interesting. It'd be a massive moneymaker. Um, right? One, two, three, four. I guess, sorry, you don't have generic white girl face? I guess. I mean, if I, if generic white girl face made me that kind of money, like, just think about the money one Taylor Swift song makes. Like, if my face was that much of a moneymaker, hell yeah, I'll be a generic white girl. I'm already not that far from it. Really? I mean, I mean, I guess. Generic. I don't know that you're generic. I mean, like, you got parts two and three down, but like. I mean, face. My face is not really ungeneric. I would say it's a pretty generic face. So you're saying your face is not distinct? Mm -hmm. My face is a face, like most other faces. Uh, well, I mean, I would, I would venture to say that not only most faces, but almost every face is, in fact, a face. Did you I'm just gonna put this out there and just remind you that I do like your face. I know you like my face, but that doesn't make it any less typical. Did you know? Did you know? Thusly generic. Did you know that all cats? And hold on, hold on to your asses. All cats are in fact cats. This is nonsense. I... You know, one of the. Um... When, when we've been doing all this crap with Liara, I had to, one of the diagnostic places that we had to take her to, they asked me what her breed was, and I was just, I instinctively was like, uh, cat. Cat. <laughs> Did they laugh at you? <laughs> they were like, uh, okay. <laughs> I was like, I don't know. <laughs> see, She's see. Allie's right. Allie, a <laughs> Allie has a name brand white girl face. <laughs> It is not generic. Well, that's fair. Mine is distinctly not name brand. Well, you say that. No, mine right. is not so name how brand. How did this happen now? I ate it. 
Oh boy. Also, Chris, for you to forget again, she's a domestic short hair. Yep. I will promptly forget that. Um, Straight to the recycling bin. I gotta tell you, I really like the way that like the double um, warped doors look like a look like an angry face. Like it almost looks like an angry sea monster face. It kind of does. Oh, you're out there. <laughs> Minnie's a street cat. <laughs> Accurate. Well, uh, Liar is a bush cat, and don't actually say that because that's actually a thing ish. And they might think she's like Australian or something, and you don't want to confuse them. Oh, crikey. <laughs> yep, so if I'm ever talking to your vet, I'll remember that. <laughs> <laughs> Not you, Chris. Visit all ice ocean biomes. Huh. Well, I'm, there's a I'm lot. Okay. These fuckers build up here quickly, don't they? Yes. Uh huh. Good lord. If you want, you can go see the the start of the mast and tell me what you think. Okay, I'm healing up see some stuff. So, oh, is that your new experience farm? You too good for the TVs now? Well, no, I just wanted to come out here anyway. That's right. You do have your captain's quarters out here. <laughs> that and if I am online, that is a better yield of experience. Sydney, though that is a, that is why ten, that is why Minnie has a tendency sometimes to yell. Yes, Siamese <laughs> are loud. They are they are loud and like she's she's part Siamese and she, well, I don't yeah. I don't have to tell the two they of you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Elliot is distinctly part Siamese because when uh, our sister in law got him, he, he, she was like, do. Does your cat yell like this? I'm like, no, 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 no. You got a Siamese. They, they, they have opinions, and they will tell you their opinions. They do. And that is, that is, not like other cats will meow occasionally or chirp or th like some of them have the cry in the middle of the night because they think they're lost thing. Like I've had that with like just your average cat, but Siamese will just give you what for to tell you whatever it is they're gonna tell you. So Sydney, what you're telling me Sounds is <laughs> So Sydney, what you're telling me is that Minnie's parents M M Minnie is 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 Marie from the Aristocats. <laughs> Riff <laughs> the, and, street cats. <laughs> oh my god, no. What? And and her mother is Duchess and her father is Thomas O'Malley. <laughs> O'Malley the Alley Cat. Riff Raff Street Cat. I want to buy that. It's Lady some of the. Uh, some of the opinions that Elliot has includes uh, doors are the devil. They are the most offensive thing on the planet. And, and give me cheese. And also, he is really meow for the cheese. He chirps very cutely for the cheese. He yells at doors and sometimes about food. Well, in his defense, doors doors are offensive. Doors are to him what pants are to you. Oh my God, pants are the fucking worst. Jesus Christ, I hate pants. That's how we he know, feels about doors. We know. Oh, is it? <laughs> is it sleepies? It's almost oh. like there's a. A captain's quarters for you to go sleep in. There is. I got. I got a place for this. Do do do. I haven't built the rest of the quarters, but. I mean, listen. I got a place. Built. Look at that. I can. I can fall asleep and remember my sweet Kitarino while I'm out here. I figured you'd want to face Kitarino. Some Siamese are not affectionate. Some of them are very affectionate. Some of them want all the uh, the affection and attention from their people. It really depends on what kind of cat, what, what like the the specific cat, because they're just Elliot wants specific amounts of attention. That might be one point two three pets, and if you go into one point two five pets, that's too many, and you will get nipped. <laughs> but he likes cuddling up against me. He likes sitting on a chair next to me or sitting on my desk next to me. But he's not big into, like, lots of pets or laps. Yeah. He's, he's affectionate within cat distance. Yeah. 
but doors are a sin, so if you go to the bathroom, he must be there. Yeah, well, I mean, you know. I'm in the nether. Uh, I'll rebed. Oh, we all probably need to resleep then. Well, one of us needs to resleep. Your face will resleep. Uh, God damn. Like, just had to go there, huh? Fucking calling you out, mate. You got told. Excuse me, I'm I'm doing very He's calling him like he sees him. I'm doing very important pirate paperwork at my desk. Captain's log. Kitterino was a very good boy. Have, have you filled out any of your bonus logs? My what? I do my... want to see what you come up with with your bonus. Oh, the... one of the chests has a couple spare books for you to write your own captain's log. Oh yeah, I got to do I that. I feel it was fair that we wrote it for you. But I also wanted to see your reaction to our version. Captain's log. Last Monday, the fish are everywhere. They won't stop spawning the fish. I'm having nightmares of fish. Oh, it's not efficient. Well, I mean, to be fair, it fuck you guys work. and the whole fish thing. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Day 72, I'm sick of fish. My crew has made it their derelict duty to remind me of fish at every moment. That's really I like the mast. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna go up a lot more and go out to either side. And then I might make, like, a smaller mast. I gotta look at some boats. Like, I might make, like, a second. Cause some boats have a couple masts, but a couple sails. God, so here we'll we see. go with the fish content again. You gotta give the people Look. what they want. <sighs> you do. It's not just all about craisins and streaming. Sometimes you gotta give them the fish content mm -hmm. they truly desire. It's not always about what you want. Mmm. Cod flavored craisins. <laughs> I'm still mad you never found me Zach's address in time before I told him my idea. And by mad, I mean not really mad. It, like, it's incredible that he didn't do that because I'm a member at the credit union where we work and we have access to copies of all of our production data. Just You're wild. In a, huh? Also in a Discord server with me. Yeah, that's that's uh, also know, an ex excellent point. That. Yeah, yeah. So. I honestly didn't think of that. Yes. But now that I now I will think of that next next time because I found this variety pack of craisins and I still might just make it show up at Zach's house someday. Yeah, don't uh, don't, don't ask my best friend Carino. don't ask my best friend who has who literally has a key to my house what my address is. That would you won't get anywhere with that. Look I do, it's We never colored. said I was smart. Ooh, I mean, you're smart. You just you know like I many. Get, I get stuck on one way to do things and then that's then everything else goes out the window for a bit. Well, yeah. Um, Less with work, but with like idea. real life things, it's terrible. Should we put a no. beacon under here at some point, or a uh, not a beacon, a, a beacon. conduit? And... Oh, please, 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 please. You want a conduit under there? Any place you'd like. Yeah. All right. I need. Does that cause a problem with spawning? No. Shouldn't. No. Because it... it just damages them. Yeah, it'll make them take a minor amount of damage before they get into the system. So, if anything, it'll make that faster. Yeah, because that is... I don't think there, there's any way it'll kill them on the way up. Yeah, I'm going like, to go... Uh, I don't nope. think it's enough damage. If it does, you know, it does come down pretty easy. So. <sighs> I mean, if it doesn't, if it does end up being a problem, it's not like they're hard to take down. Uh, all right, Swaggy, thanks for stopping by. Appreciate it. See you later. See ya. Oh, that reminds me. Sydney. Sydney, look at your chat messages. Look to the left of your name. Do you see anything new and fancy there? Ooh. Ooh. Fancy robe. Fancy robe. That's right. Sub badges are live, y'all. And I'm working on getting the uh, the emotes approved. I got. I only have one emote slot right now. So I elected to do the milk stein, but we will, but we will, we will do it. Bang you quicker. 
Justice for Kitarino. We're saving Kitarino for last because Kitarino is the bestest boy. Mm-hmm. First you starve him of fish, then you starve him of emotes. I didn't starve him of emotes. There's Kitarino merch. I know. I, oh, I know. Hold on. Uh, not only did you starve him of fish, you then went on to record an ad about Tab's poor cat not being fed enough. Well, I mean, whatever. Just right in the junk. Fuck you, you Kitarino. That's what that You're message the... was. Fuck you, right in the junk or whatever. Oh my. How did I do that? Oh. Thoughts. I did not actually bring an entire stack of beef with me. I wonder if I will run out of food before I run out of pick. Hmm, pick. This will be interesting. And... Okay. No, so then let's go up here. Let's go to my. Da, da, da. He did not. Yeah. So Coco bought. He bought the. He bought a milk stein hoodie, which I'm curious to see how it looks. Like it looks good. I hear good things. We'll see what happens. You know. The kitty's coming to my house. That's 100%. So there we go. Exclamation point merch. Swag. And there you can buy merch. You can buy Kitarino and Milkstein merch, including t shirts, mugs, and hoodies. I thought about putting tank tops, but I was like, hmm. For people who don't live in Florida or are Chris and still use hoodies in Florida. Listen, he's 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 a he's a very cold boy. He's very cold bolt. He is. Mm hmm I I wish I could I I mean I guess there are a couple days I can use hoodies, but it's like Rare. I fucking love Kohler. Jesus Christ, I love Kohler. Like, this is Yeah. He's he's a he's a good Coco. I see a lollipop still chewing through some some stuff over there. Hi. I was gonna try I, I was throwing money at the screen as soon as you mentioned purple Kitarino's shirt. I was like, um, where? Hello. Hello. I'm trying not to hit you. Are I know. Are there zombies near you? Are there zombies near me? I hear them. Nope. I don't see any. I don't hear them, so it's not Zach's stream. Nope. Uh, no, I just got home. There's that no is zombies. the sound zombies make, yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> undead sons of bitches, where are you? Show yourselves, fuck faces. There. I think they're under there. Dildos. Did you check your butt? God damn it. <laughs> I mean, she she makes an excellent point. Three or four of them hanging around trying to get into Trader Tom's. Around your butt? You're welcome here, especially. I, I just like how Tom's is not even... Not even dealing with our shit. No, he's oh. he 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 fully oh, does not give a shit. Wait, what Chivo did you get? Overkill. Oh, because you did like hella damage to something. Well, I think I hit more than one of them at once, and that Chivo is for dealing nine hearts of damage in a single hit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That'll do it. But it doesn't necessarily say to a single entity. Right. All right. So um. So I'm going to ask a couple of questions here, Elena, because this is, you're the one who cares the most about this. Do you want the, first of all, do you want the conduit visible or not? I don't give a fuck. If it's, as I, if it's visible, I want it prettified with like prismarine blocks, but well, it not, like just. Well, it has, it to, has be to be prismarine. Yep. Then perfect. 
I then I give no fucks. Okay, then I'm gonna take. I'm just gonna take some regular prismarine, and what I will do is I will put it. So you know the roof at the top of the um, the actual like water monument. Uh-huh. I'm going to dig underneath the roof and put it under it and then just like it'll be hidden underneath so you won't even see it. Cool. I don't I don't care one way or the other. Do whatever makes sense to you. I you think probably also pro- don't need to bring any prismarine with you. Thonking. Yeah, you're 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 not wrong, but also uh, You already did, so. I mean, you know, Old habits die hard. Being prepared and all that. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't care because that's a pretty enough structure. So it didn't bother me one way or the other. It just, I didn't. I didn't. I haven't studied conduits. I didn't want one like made of dirt or something. No, like, conduits have to be. Know. Conduits have to be made of prismarine. Um, prismarine, prismarine bricks, or dark Turkata. prismarine. Or what? The pink terracotta. Pink terracotta. No, you cannot make a conduit out of pink terracotta. I'll make, a, Mo wishes I'll you make could. one out of whatever the fuck I want. I don't think you'll make a conduit. You'll you'll make a, a an arrangement of blocks. You could make a conduit and then surround it with pink terracotta, so probably. True. Alright, so I'm gonna... Let's dig in here. Let's go down here. Oh. Oh, well this will work out. This will work out nicely. I'm going to take out right because it's only two blocks right there. Hmm. All right. Let's see here. Now for America's favorite new game show. How many times am I going to fucking rebuild this because I keep getting different ideas? Hmm. Eighteen hundred and seventy-two. Water, here? water breathing? Me? Yeah. No, yeah, that's fine. I'll just I'll I I had to dig out first, then I'll come up for air, and then I'll go back down there. Like it only take me a second to build the thing. That'll make One. killing squid so much better. Like Lockhart seconds. He's got you there. He really has you there. I do. You got me in a box here. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So let's see here. Like uh, you of all people don't get to count seconds when someone says a second. I do, though. On the grounds that I want to. I mean, sure. But you're wrong. And that's okay. Damn. We love you anyways. I mean, get wrecked or whatever. Fine. Yes, that's He's going to be to good. It. The villagers will all be standing in front of a too tall uh, sea lantern. Oh. Wall. See? So they'll be backlit, is basically what I'm telling you. Oh, I like that. Ooh. Sea light pop. Well, we're all good I here. I know a place you can farm sea lantern stuff. Well, I did that last stream, or last stream I was on. And that's why I have enough to do this. Ah. Mm-hmm. We might need to farm more, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. I mean, it'll be farmed because, I mean, Zach's messing around there, so I'm sure it's running. He's doing the mess around. I, I am. I am. It's true. Wait, we need to be in a bed? Uh, it's getting there. You might not okay. be quite quite there just right this second, but real close. Um. I think we have a fully, yeah, it looks like we have a fully powered conduit. Uh, oh, that's a, oh, nope, nope. I need to get that one back. Uh, or I'll just put a different one in and no one will, no one will know. You conduit. Oh, no, that's not, wait. Um, is that, no, that's not going to be fully powered. Okay, so I will have one block that I will put on the outside. It's fine. The monsters aren't going to be looking at it that closely. Well. No, really, they're not. Um, how, how upset would you be if there was like one stray block out here? 
Whatever. Okay. Let me just make sure this is the right one. I would be very offended. Well, I didn't ask That's you. That's fine. I thought we were a team. We're a we are. We're a crew. But just like you have final say of Trader Tom's, I'm pretty sure that uh, Captain Hoppers and I have final say on different parts of the boat. It's offensive. Area. I'm hmm. offended. Hmm. That's fine. You're allowed to be offended. It's true. You too are allowed to be wrong. Offended. Hey, bud. What you doing? I'm healing up my hoe. Oh, dang. My hoe. I'm going to do the sleepies. I'm just so happy with the lighting in there. Yeah, it's this is just... I gotta tell you, like, I'm just... I'm floored every time I, I look at it. I put those cubes in just to fuck with your brain. I know you did. Uh, I hear skeletons. Oh. The sideways stairs. Oh, that was a skeleton. Where the... Probably that dirt. Uh, either the dirt or up top. The dirt on the mast. Maybe. Up top has more lighting, though. Not all the lighting, but... Still. Oh. I'll and work on it at some point. Many of the lighting. Over here too, this there's no lighting here and this is this is flat and True. That is that is those are high because I wanted the fence to touch them. Yeah. That's lit, so it's probably not the top. It's probably the side or the mast. Probably. I'll fix it later. Yeah, it's fine, like how how much of a actually, problem is the, it? No, those are those are lit. Those are lit. There's uh, things under them, under the side. So under here, like there's there's sea lanterns underneath there. Are these slabs? And I believe it comes up. Yeah. Yeah. Take one down. Put it around. Oh, okay. Okay, then. Yeah, I guess he did have to I come from clever. over there. Oh, no, no. I, I have no doubt. It doubts. might be somewhere in the back. I, I haven't. Clever girl. All right, here I we like go. hiding lighting. It's becoming my new hobby. You like that? Isn't that fun? Zoop and... Hmm... Tasty, tasty conduit mm -hmm. power. Tastes like conduit. Does that mean it tastes like sea pickle? Listen, I, I, I can neither confirm nor deny what tastes like sea pickles. I mean, I'm just asking for a friend. For a friend. Mm -hmm. Friend is me. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Bitch ate my chicken nuggies. <laughs> it you? It's me. I'm bitch. Oh yeah, yeah. We got conduit power all through the complex now. So yep. I wonder. Nice. Wonder what the extent is. That's exciting. So because it's a full conduit? I'm in an ocean slime chunk, and it's primarily annoying. I cannot even see the monument. And, and I'm still under conduit power. Cannot see the monument, and I'm under conduit power. So let's let's see how far I can get. Oh, 
Okay, so this is about the extent. Okay, now let's swim back over there and see how far is away I am. Is that cutting out? No. Oh, okay. And, ooh. We got some good distance on this thing. This is very nice. Very nice. He's going the distance? He's going for speed. Are the thingies still coming up the thing? Place, Chris. Are you asking about are the guardians still coming up here? The squeaky hoozy, what's it? It's... Yes. Sorry, I couldn't hear you over the sound of them dying in my ear. <laughs> hey, um, Elena, I know that you've been like slowly but surely replacing like the stone columns, like that are outside with. The prismarine bricks. There's a bunch still inside uh -huh. here. Do you want me to just grab some and start uh -huh. doing that? I mean, if you feel like it, absolutely. I just, it's been a, it was, it was a project I was doing while I was waiting for other materials. And so it's been backed burnered with my ideas for the boat, but it's definitely something I want done. Okay. It's one of those, like, I want it done, but I haven't made time to do it. Does that make sense? Yep. And we also need to, like, put back all the stuff that we took off of this place originally. To kind of seal it back up. Like on the exterior? Yeah. Yeah. Seal it back up, make, make it more look more like a, an untouched, untouched temple. Yeah, like, if you want to hollow it out, I don't give a shit about that, as long as the pillars stay, but... Okay. Well, that's that's we can do that. That's fine. But the would the be kind of nice to make the. Yeah, I want to make the outside look nice at some point. It's yeah. Been. Hell, you know what you can do? Hollow it out, build in the rest of it, then we go get all those sponges and um. We clean out the inside. Yeah, you know where the sponges are. And then, well, actually, I don't know if there are any sponges well, in here. Well, if we do that, then ne never mind. Well, never mind, because if we did that, thinking about it, then what would the point of the conduit be? Yeah, I don't, I don't, I think if anything, I might make a couple rooms with like waterlogged beds down there, but I still got to figure that out. I, I basically hollowing it out and messing with it later is my, my jam. And or making it pretty on the outside. <clears throat> Okay, Allie, don't talk to me. Uh, don't don't talk to me about Hercules until we talk about the muses. Like Hercules, Hercules. Until I got my coffee. <laughs> yes, also yes, but the muses like just phenomenal. Oh. Five that way. They can sing like good lord. Oh. So the stone pillars that are inside, I'm going to leave those because those are our indicators that those are the good pillars that we need to leave. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, leave the, them inside, but on the outside, make them... On the outside, we'll just make them the, the bricks. My, my plan is to make the pillars prismarine, whichever prismarine I used, I already used one, um... And then do a layer of sea lantern pattern and then a layer of slabs under that so it's lit on top and underneath. But you don't see them. Um, but, but you don't see them. It just looks like it's a platform. Like, you can see where I started that if you go to one section underneath. Uh, that's my plan to do that uh, on the whole thing. Patio, I guess is what I'm going to call it. Um, I just... A, the supplies, and B... I have lots of ideas. I am only one me. No, that's that's <laughs> a, yeah. I mean, well, I mean, look at the fucking boat. Holy shit, the boat! Like, good gravy. I have lots of ideas. 
you, but I am you, only one me. It can only build so fast. You have lots of ideas, and many of them are just just sh- top-notch chef's kiss level ideas, I gotta tell you. <laughs> well, there's an itch on my foot. Itch on my foot. Ah. Yeah. I think Chris is very happy that he left the uh, guardian thing to me. Yes. I was like, I'm very happy you were like, but you've got ideas. And I was like, there is, there is no ideas. (laughs) There is no ideas, only Zool. Yeah, I thought you had ideas because I'd been kind of envisioning a boat for like a day or so. And you were like, no. Even if you did, even like even if I did have an idea, I feel like yours would have blown mine out of the water regardless because I am not that creative. So <laughs> out of the water, <laughs> out of the water. <laughs> and into the boat. Not unlike, not unlike a boat that is out of the water. It's just dry docked right now. It's under construction. She'll sail one day. God, don't don't give Shale. don't give me false hope. <laughs> Listen, if there was a way for us to take that boat as it sat and put it in the water and put it in motion, you goddamn better believe we would sail the seven seas <laughs> on that beautiful some bitch. That would be fat. Holy shit. Right? Can you imagine? There is a lot of water around this place. There's like, only one person who could possibly make that happen. And who is that? Mango. Oh, Jesus. Hey, will you quit? Get out of here. Get. Hey, I hit you with an egg, okay? Well, I don't think he'll play bedrock. I, I escalated. No, Mango will not play bedrock. But also, you're right. Mango is literally the only person that could make that happen. Ah, there we go. But Jesus Christ, could he make it happen? With the, the penis no boat. Huh? I With the what? Like since it's made out of the, the, the nether wood, it actually, it actually would float. You've... You have seen that, right? <laughs> Which no, what his his thing with the bee nest? No, I've seen yeah. I've seen Tabs's Ooh. bee nest. Are you okay? I know. <laughs> a no oh, float he's boat. I'm gonna find you a thing. I think I think Tom has died. All right, there we go. Uh, here we are. This is the whole reason Teb has the bee nest. Oh, okay. Let's... Let's Let's all go watch a story. Oh, God. So, Il Mango is German. Yes, he is, in fact, German. That's important to know. Yeah. All right. Wonder. This is our home. Thanks, thanks, Ad. Okay, I'll, I will give the Ad a minute to finish being an Ad. Stupid Ad. Stupid. All right, skip Ad. All right, let's see if we can share this. Let's see if this will work. Oh my 12, god. 12 cube of 
B-nest blocks. Mind the B-nest blocks. I use the B-nest blocks as a de decoration. Really hard. Not all of the B-nest blocks are filled. Mine all of the B-nest blocks. Now let's break those B-nest blocks. We need to start here at the back. Bees that are inside of the B-nest. Inside of the B-nest. This way. All of the B-nest. Have some B-nest inside. Some B-nest inside. Some B-nest inside. No way to break the B-nest somehow. I really want to keep the B-nest. We can store the B-nest blocks. Yeah, B-nest blocks are sticking out. The B-nest. B-nest. did not fill all the B-nest. So we still have a lot less to spend. So B-nest. Yeah, I guess that's a nice view of it. B-nest. Bye-bye. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> oh lord, I've killed him. <laughs> oh man. Whoo, doggy. That is that is good. Uh, oh, sweet so mango. That, that is why Tab got the nest. That's... That's outstanding. I love it. I, that's the origin. <laughs> the the Beanus origin story. <laughs> we want to keep the Beanus. <laughs> Unfortunately, really... you cannot you cannot break the Beanus. Beanus, Beanus, Beanus. I am actually unrelated to any of that. Really excited for the conduit because that will make the underneath stuff so much easier. Yeah, because like, you don't have to come lantern. up for you don't have to come up for air. Yeah. You don't have to like try to fumble fumble around in the dark. Like you can just see what you're doing. Well so that was good. my main problem was that I'd had to come up for air and then I'd get to like the middle pillars and by the time I get to the middle middle pillar, replace like three blocks and then get back out and it's just like, oh my god I think that's kind of why I was like, you know what sounds easier? Building a boat. Building a boat. <laughs> the whole boat. I was wrong. The boat was not easier, but <laughs> at the time it sounded easier. <laughs> it sounded like a good idea at the time. Correct. Ah, uh, that was fantastic. All right, so that's that. I need to get home and drink my milk. What did you get? What what debuff did you get? Uh, there was raiders by the uh, water temple. Oh. That's the lost ark. Yeah, apparently. Hey, uh, don't uh -huh. go anywhere near Trader Tom's. No, Please. that's why I'm running home to to get my oh, my hey, milk. Oh, look at that. What is it? The sleepy sleeps? Oh, look at that. Uh, well, I guess let me surface. You've got a minute. I gotta make myself a space to sleep. I'm in. I'm always in my tunnel, so it takes me a minute to set up my stuff. Oh, there's a spot right here. Well, lovely. That's fantastic. That's been my, <laughs> my work bed. <laughs> Just floating. You might need to resleep because. I just nope. dumped myself back in the nether. It worked. Roll. Oh. Hey, look. Hmm. There's a cake in front of my mailbox. Oh, hey, that's a cake. And there's pistons and levers and redstones and torch eye. Mm. Mm. Yeah. You, can't, you can't break a cake, so it just has to live here until we eat it all. It's true. We were really sad. We we, we named the, the cake a virtue lie, but since it's placed, it doesn't actually show that. Oh, and I can never see it. Yeah. Because it was... Once you place the cake, I guess it doesn't yeah. show the no. thing. So, I, I tried the same thing with, thing. The virtue, with Pumpkin Bot, and that's why I wound up putting a sign on him. Gotcha. What were you saying, Chris? I, I saw a thing a while back that I, I, I feel like would be a cool, cool idea for us. Okay. Someone put a bucket of milk on an item frame and put a sign on it that said, in case of emergency, break glass. Oh, that's that's fantastic. I love it. I absolutely and I think we can, and I think we can one up that idea by renaming a bucket 
of milk, the milk stein. Oh. Oh. Oh, I, I like, feel like I like this very much. I almost kind of want to add that to your captain's chambers. You can, I mean, we can put we that, can have multiple um, milk steins. You could put that horizontally on his desk. Oh, that's true. You could. You could place it, like, directly on the surface of the desk. Well, no. No, she can't, because the surface of the desk is is bottom slab. slab. Oh. Yeah. Is it bottom slab or is it top slab? It's bottom slab, because it's directly on top of um, those observers. Oh, right. Oh, well. That was a really good idea, though. I like that idea. I could put it in place of one of your flowers, though. And, and you mean my crazy? Next to your bed. No. Oh, the flowers, flowers. The flowers, flowers. Oh, the corn flowers. Yeah. Oh. I could put it there because those are just planks with trapdoors on them. That's true. They are. So you could have it in, next to your bed. You know, drink a drink a warm glass of milk before bed to help you sleep. That's true. That's happening whenever I come back from wherever the hell I am. <laughs> from wherever the hell I am. Trapdoor was a man. We're going to get a postcard from Elena that says, Hello from beautiful wherever the hell I am. <laughs> Wish you were here. <laughs> Wish you were here. Wherever the hell I am. Wish you were, people... Wish you were here, Wish... maybe, or not. I don't know. <laughs> Look, if people in the book series I was just reading can name their towns hell knows where, I, that I, I feel like I can call wherever the hell I am. Oh. Oh. Oh? Uh-oh. What is O? Oh? That doesn't sound like a good O. Oh. That sounds like a bad O. Oh. Uh, well, it's not... I mean, it's not optimal. But it isn't that bad of an inconvenience. The corners of this thing are very fucky. And I always build them wrong at first. I... Oh. Yeah, see? That's exactly correct. Oh, I yeah, see. Yeah, she... So it goes... Yeah, okay. This That makes way more sense. <laughs> what I did was very dumb. <laughs> Actually, no... Every day of my life there, friend. Every day of my life. Wait a minute. Oh, fuck. What? Okay, now it's a catastrophe. Oh, God. What What happened? Uh, misspacing. Oh. Yeah, I've done that before with the sorting majig. I, 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 I empathize with you. God, I hate these fucking corners. Yeah, mm, the corners are the worst. Let me tell you, trying to maneuver hoppers in corners is a pain in the dick, too. Especially when you've already boxed in the corner with stones or whatever. Dude, trying to maneuver hoppers at all. Like, the few hoppers I had to use for the TVs was too many hoppers as far as I was concerned. I'm telling you. Like, Captain, like, you, you, we joke about me being Captain fucking Hoppers, but I don't wish that fate on anyone. Certainly not going to be my fate. I will build you boats. I will prettify things. <laughs> Fuck <Right>. Hoppers. <laughs> I will use Hoppers for lighting. That will be the best use I make of Hoppers. Okay. Shit. You're... And while I feel that is a very good use of Hoppers... It is not the use of hoppers. Tom, you okay, bud? That makes sense. Oh, I mean, I'll live. I think I've resealed the outside, or most of it anyway. Cool. Let's come around here and see. Yeah, okay. I get it. I might have to go... Check the belly of it and make sure it's sealed up down there too. 
belly of the beast. The belly of the beast. That llama is living his best life right now. What, the one on the roof of the barn? What, roof yeah, llama? I, just, I keep having to walk <laughs> past him, and he's just he's just up there having a good old time. They do do that. And... Let's see, what do we got down I thought here? you were talking about a llama at the ocean, and all llamas that uh, visit the uh, SS Crazens are respectfully requested to retire. Are respectfully requested to fuck right off. We asked them politely but firmly to leave. <laughs> yes. They are encouraged to uh, join their villager friends at the Virtue Tom retirement <laughs> community. Oh, that's good. What's the, f what's the first part of that line? I can never remember. Like, what if someone, what if someone asks for charcoal? No, what if someone asks for their steak? Well done. done. Well done. Is it the is that the well done one? Oh. We asked them politely but firmly to leave. All right, I think I've sealed up the belly of it too. It's a king of the hill joke. It's a... Oh, okay. Clean burning propane, propane and propane accessories. You know what's really nice about this whole thing is like the getting to hear the underwater music forever because I'm just down here and I've got the conduit and I can just do this forever. Like, I could live here. I could do everything down here but sleep. That doesn't mean you need to sleep. Hmm. Doesn't, doesn't mean I need to yawn. Doesn't not mean that. Well, I mean, okay, that's, that's, that's a fair point, I suppose. All right, I'm moving the conduit over by a block. Because the outside block is now bothering me. <laughs> if it's bothering you, it would bother me eventually, but block. For, for water breathing, I would be willing to tolerate quite a bit, so. Building kick. Explosions! So the corners are actually in the right spot. It's everything else that's fucked up. Which is hilarious. No, it's the children who are wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this is the time I watched Mo like, be off by one block and have to redo like an entire wall's worth of work. Yeah, that sounds about right. Thankfully, I didn't get very far into it. This isn't <sighs> the worst thing that could have happened. My Papa Reno needs to go out, so I will be RB. Okay. Hey, Chris, while you're up, can you make sure I turn the dryer on? And didn't just, like, stick the clothes in it? Can you get me a beer? We don't have any beer here. You're on your own for that one. Um, didn't say it had to come from your house. No, but that's the only place you're getting anything from us, because we don't leave the house. Leave the house and bring me a beer, Chris. No. I'm, Maybe post-pandemic. You. You and I'm saying no. Maybe post-pandemic. It, it'll it only take yeah. him a minute. J Jesus. It's not the minute. It's the leaving the house. We have Do we rules. have Minecraft on the Switch? No. I've bought and this game. why not? Because I bought this game enough times. <laughs> you have you have Minecraft literally everywhere else. I will find a way to mail else. order you a beer. I mean, you could drizzly him a beer. I can't. Not, not in this state. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. The heck is a drizzly? Uh, it's it's. It's like a Grubhub for booze. Yeah, it's it's ah, it's okay. exactly that. Okay. I wouldn't know. I don't drink. All of this is foreign languages to me. I don't either. I don't. I don't drink most of the time. I've had a week. You have had I, a week, I and I'm that. I'm sorry that for the week that you had, especially given the week that it was. I'm very very sorry for that. I blame. I don't know who to blame yet. Uh, me. What do we do? You didn't you get him a beer. Son of a 
bitch. Jesus Christ, oh. Lollipop. Why didn't you get him the beer? That's the only thing he wanted. <laughs> After the fucking week here. here fucking get it. It's only a 20 minute drive. It's fine. You should have come here to get it. 20, 20 minute drive for me. We we say everything's tw- well. We have a friend in Ohio who jokes that it, we're just twenty minutes away, and his friend in the Netherlands is just twenty minutes away from him. So everything is just twenty minutes away. Clearly. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, if if the Netherlands that, that, are, that's what's going on. If the Netherlands <laughs> I, are twenty minutes away, <laughs> then Tom is definitely twenty only twenty minutes away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I also had a friend that was in the Philippines, and I would tell him that I would make him a sandwich if he would swim here to come get it. <laughs> hey, Allie, can you get Tom a beer and tell him Chris got it for him so that Chris can get I, him his beer without leaving the house? Why wouldn't Why wouldn't she want credit for the beer? Well, she can have like credit for delivering the beer. I just somehow Chris it needs to be Chris's fault so that well Chris's success fault whatever. So that you are delivered your beer. Six half dozen. I, and no one leaves us at the house. I, I wouldn't hate it if a beer showed up here, my dearest wife. You do have a wonderful and dearest wife. She's 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 most good. And Speaking of very that, wifely, I, I might say. I still need I still need the wife girl scout cook those girl scout cookies. I am stalking self promotion. I thought she oh I thought she did it. Um Hang on. And make it happen. Sonic's not even that far out of the way, though, Sydney. Like, it's really not. I think we're going to go get Sonic again tomorrow because we went last Saturday. And normally we don't go get it because, like, it usually the grease is, is a little too much for Sabrina's Tum Tum. But when we went last week, um, it was great. And she got a cherry limeade. And I got two Route 44 sweet teas out of it. So. And did you know that it's always happy hour in the app? So that means drinks are always half priced in the app. So order in the app and just tell them what fucking what fucking uh, stall you're in, and shit will just magically appear there. It's fucking great. Let me tell you, they're great. Oh no, it's right, sleepy sleeps. Going, Hey, there it is. Huh. Elena has left the realm. I mean, I have shopping to do. Uh, let me see if I can figure out how to get out of here, and I will sleep. I'm lost now. Oh, God damn it! This happened last time I was here. <laughs> get wrecked. <laughs> get wrecked, me. Oh, I guess I can just go out of the, the, the top here. It's all right. I'm going to continue to... Ah. <laughs> <I don't... laughs> Mr. Cage, where's your podium? I don't know where it went. I'm confused. You lost your podium. You know what? I don't care. <laughs> That's true. You don't. That's you. You don't like. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Ooh, another person who doesn't talk. I don't either. That's what Chris is for. I make him make my phone calls and things. It's true. You do, and I know this because <laughs> usually, usually I spend, usually I spend basically all day on the phone with him, like on our work computers, like like on Teams at work. And so, you know, every once in a while, he'll take a break from me bugging him, just being in his ear to go make phone calls. So, and I think sometimes he takes a break just because he spends enough time of his life talking to me and listening to me talk. So, which is totally no, fair. It's definitely because I make him make, go, go take phone calls and things. No, I mean, it it's can be both is what I'm saying. Stuff. She'll never guess I don't what's think happening. I've ever been like, hey, you know what? I don't feel like talking to Zach right now. I'm going to just leave. I don't think I've ever done that. Well, that makes me feel kind of special. You'll, you'll just never guess what's happened. 
What what happened? Did you fuck up the corner again? Please tell me you fucked up the corner again. I actually don't oh, want you to beer. have fucked up the corner. A, a beer has a beer has appeared. What? Ta-da! You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. You had nothing to do with it, you lazy fuck. Well, actually, I didn't actually not have anything did. to do with it. I, I didn't not have anything to do with it. For the beer, made Allie aware of your desire for the beer. So she actually provided it, but you asking Chris, Chris, Chris did help by existing for you to ask him for a beer. Uh, yeah, no. <laughs> I don't know. This, this all, this, the, the math checks out. <laughs> Allie did all the work. Yes, I agree. Al- Allie came in with the assist on this one. She gets like. 12% of the credit? Partial uh, credit? I got that reference. I thought we were having a moment. We were having 12% of a moment. <laughs> <laughs> Christopher. Oh, you really fucked up. Damn. Like, it's one thing the real when. The question you... is is she going to give me the middle name treatment? It's, it's, it's one. Brennan, if you need it. Oh, we, we're, we're all aware. <laughs> We we all know. Thanks. I don't know if Ali has it memorized. I don't. I don't probe Ali's memory to know exactly so what she does. So how's the weather underneath that bus? <laughs> oh boy! Did you get the uh, Did you get the the license plate on that thing or? <laughs> hey, a list of his schedule and fears. I need someone to tell me how good the lemon ups are because if I only get one box and they're amazing, I'm gonna be sad. What? Welcome back, Swaggy. Lemon ups. I don't know. I don't think I've ever gotten them. Um. Yeah, I don't. I don't know either. I'll tell you what we get. We get the fucking s'mores. I got a See, box of s'mores, I'm... and Sabrina gets us a, a box of s'mores. All right, I guess that you convinced me to add a box of s'mores instead of a second box of lemon ups. Let me tell you, the Man. fucking s'mores are just like holy shit; they're life changing. We did Thin Mints, Samoas, Tagalongs, and uh, s'mores. Mmm, Samoas. Those are. You know how I feel about Samoas. I know. I know how you feel about Samoas. Let me tell you. There's some magic ass cookies. Holy shit! Like, especially there's... if they're named Dwayne. Ha. <laughs> There is a wrestler named Samoa Joe, and they did do a skit where he was selling Girl Scout cookies. Wait, and someone didn't want Samoas, and he was gonna fuck them up Wait. real bad. Is or was is he still around? He's around, but I believe he does mostly commentary now. Okay, because I paid attention to wrestling when I was a kid, and he was a thing back then. Yeah, Back in the day, if you will. Last thing I heard you, I don't, I, I, I don't watch the show he's on, but last I heard he was doing commentary. Still, he had a bunch of injuries and shit, and, you know. Chris, and that always the way though. What would you like? My purse, because I don't take PayPal. Gasp! You right. want, you want my credit card number real quick? Nah, oh, I got okay. this one. Okay. I mean, I wasn't going to give it to you. I really, I was just asking <laughs> if you wanted it. And... But I don't want it. Well, that's good. I mean, that that kind of works out then. Then we're all we're all good here. I get points on my credit card. I don't get points on your credit card. You might get points, but I don't. I sure do. I get I get one and a half percent cash back on everything. Ooh, uh-huh. I can't remember if I'm at two or two and a half. It's Samuel L. Jackson. Listen. Let the let the let the man let the man make his promotional money, okay? Every purchase, every day. That's right. There's dolphins down here. The dolphins will swim down here with me every once in a while. Hello, buddy. Noom. We just swim around together, being dolphins and and friends and stuff. It's great. Oh, am I floating? Nom, 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 Why nom, am I girl. floating? I should not be floating. No, that's gonna fuck things up if I do it that way. 
right, we'll come back for you. All right, there we go. Oh, it's because it was only too high and I was in the middle of swimming. Do dolphins have to come up for air? Can they drown? I have no idea. Lol. <laughs> I did see one instance of someone being killed by one, though. Very impressive. I got attacked but not killed, but that's because I accidentally hit one. They were drowned. I feel like he was talking about in real life. Oh, are you talking about real life? No. No, well, I thought you were talking about real life. No. no. Oh. Nay, nay. <laughs> oh, nay, nay. Oh. I mean, we're in Florida. A dolphin murder incident would not surprise me. Aw, Uncle Tom is a top supporter. Yarp. And the uh, percentage of goal uh, updates in real time, and that made me happy. But they can't figure out PayPal. I mean, they probably could figure out PayPal. It's probably a fee versus they probably have some deal with in-house credit card processing. Um, PayPal wants their money one way or the other. Well, credit card processing, they're go they're going to charge their fee. I'm let me tell you right now. Sure, but I think Pay PayPal's might be worse cuz I know some places don't. I don't know. I don't oh, know. That is better. Either way, I'm happy to give them my money and get my cookies eventually. Hmm, cookies eventually. They will be surprise cookies cuz I will promptly have forgotten this like in 2 days. 2 days. I expect you to forget by the end of the stream. Nah. I still got the tabs open, and I haven't cleared the email out of my inbox yet. Oh, okay. You know, all right. All so you incidentally remember them. Plus, it'll show up on your credit card. I, I, I skim through that, but I'm mostly looking for shit that I don't recognize. I don't really, like, look at every single thing and be like, oh, what is that? And You're not, you, you know, it's true, Allie. Like, dolphins are, dolphins are, like, they're cute. But they are smart, and they're too smart for their own good, and for anybody else's too. Dolphins are assholes. Like they're really no, cute. No, no. Dolphins if are. Too, if we're too talking smart for anyone else's good, that's octopus. Yeah, but like octopi are not evil. Um, Squids are evil. Octopi. octopi are pretty damn escape artists. I don't think we can know if they're evil or not. We certainly don't know what the hell they're thinking. I don't think they're evil. I just think they're like they're they they are incredibly smart. Sure. Yeah. See, they're curious. I don't think, I don't think dolphins That's why their are friends evil. call them whiskers. <laughs> I know. Them. Everybody knows that the moon is not made of green cheese. But what so if it were made of barbecue dolphins? spare ribs? Would you eat it then? Heck, I would. <laughs> What do what do dolphins do to make them be evil? To you? They do some evil, evil rapey stuff. Yeah, yes. yeah. There you go. Like Done. <laughs> Done. That's and if that's not enough, they bully other animals. But yeah, no, they're they're pretty bad. Yeah, no, it's bad. Oh, so many wedgies. Douchebags on porpoise. I'm also, I've also seen uh, some stuff about uh, things seals do to penguins, and oh my god. Oh yeah, no. seals seals are mean too. Don't make me sad. Just let me believe the cute things are cute. <laughs> Papalimo is very cute, if not false. I, I, I believe you that all these things are, are mean, but let me just enjoy the cute thanks. Let me live in let me live in my 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 little world of denial. <laughs> yes. These facts do not add anything to my life, so it's not like I need to know them, so would you they are sea puppers, no more, no less. Leave them alone. There's nothing wrong, more to talk about here. <laughs> I said we're done here. <laughs> Oh, 
dildo. But what kind? Huh? <laughs> oh, now she I'm wants to know. <laughs> I'm just being a shit. Please ignore me. <laughs> what? <laughs> you would oh, never. I, I cannot fathom this. Okay. That's fair. <laughs> I am sweet and innocent and all that is pure and good in this world. Yeah, okay, don't. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> maybe maybe take about 20% off there. 80% of all that is good in this world? Oh, so you're a bullshit artist. <laughs> Did you bullshit anyone this week? Did you try to bullshit anyone this week? <laughs> I mean, yes. I try to bullshit my husband every week. It works. And it keeps working. Uh, I haven't figured out why it's not reference. working. Uh, History of the World Part 1. What a great, great movie. Ooh! Okay. Well, since I'm safely Your under home. the water... Uh, Your choice. Alright. It's crazy and break time! Um, I'm gonna do OG. We're gonna, we're gonna keep it... We're gonna keep it original tonight and do the OGs. Because this is, this is good stuff. Um, also... I think we're going to turn the lights blue because of the ambiance. I might have just blew myself. <laughs> oh, well. Sorry, I can't sleep. I'm on a break. I guess I could back out of the realm for a minute. I mean, I had a lot of things to do today. <laughs> Did you take a Did nap? you know what I did instead? <laughs> I took a nap. Elliot also took a nap. It was a very good nap. Sauce break. Oh, listen, I have, I have the sauce. The sauce is here. I will eventually take a sauce break. I don't know. I might make that like a like a hella channel point redemption. I don't know yet. Mm. I'm I'm telling you, we need these extra channel point redemptions. I know. I know. I need to come up with other gimmicks to do. You know, other than I mean, eating. You already got the party lights on back there. It's true, I do. Hmm. Lost in the sauce. I, I will get lost in that sauce. You've seen me go ham on a can of cranberry sauce. Holy God. I love it. You can make chicken the milk sign a, uh, a thing. Yeah, and then I'd have to get another mini fridge to put up here to keep milk in. Aren't they making like an Xbox mini fridge or something? They're actually so talking about it. Fridge, and if he could fit it in there, <laughs> he could fit a full size one in there. So channel points are just things that you earn from watching the the, the stream. Um, Twitch does that automatically. Um, there are some default things that you can redeem them for, like highlighting a message. Um, but also there are custom things. And right now the only custom thing that I have on the channel is the, um, is the crazen break. That's it. That's all I got. But it's here. Hmm. So crazy. Mm. So you can slowly save them up for when he puts something that will actually annoy him or something on the channel. Yes, that's surely. true. I mean, if you start saving now, then when he puts up hella things, people will have points to do the hella things. Oh. Alright. We do need a sauce break. I'll think about doing a sauce break. Maybe I could, maybe that could be a thing. Sauce. I feel like if Sauce. I'm going to keep supporting a stream like this, I'm going to need to invest in Ocean Spray as a stock. Um, I'm not sure Ocean if... Ocean Spray to the moon! I don't know that Ocean Spray is publicly traded. You're making my dream... You're crushing my dreams here. No. It does seem that way, doesn't it? It is, in fact... It is publicly traded... My memes aren't dreams. 
Actually, they are because buying stocks is hella hard for me, but whatever. You should uh, make another point redemption to feed an entire stack of fish to Kid Arena. Yes, justice for Kid Arena. Lord. We need a ju justice for Kid Arena. Channel point redemption. Oh, butts. It's not my fault. Look, the people have demanded fish content. It is your duty to provide the fish and content. <laughs> fish and content separately, it loses the whole meaning. Like, <laughs> we met on the internet. Like, you know how hashtags work. This is not how they work. Like, <laughs> didn't didn't the two of you meet because of Twitter? Yes. Where hashtags are most well, prominent? I mean, they were just pound signs before Twitter. I mean, maybe she's out to f match with other content hashtags, okay? You don't gotta hate. Yes. Yeah, that's literally what he does. Have you met Tom? Uh, his his entire uh, existence revolves uh, around hating stuff. Are you sure? <laughs> I have not met Tom in person to know what his existence does or does not revolve around. Yeah, or I is think this you've... it. Like, is this the the full Tom experience right here? Yeah, this is this is pretty much yeah, it. I don't change myself for any reason. Yeah, no, you're 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 getting you're getting the whole the whole the whole dealio the whole shebang. Yep. The the entire potato. You're getting the full it's potato it's here. It's ever gonna get. <laughs> you peaked. <laughs> what? Hey, at least you peaked. peaked. My God. But I get stronger, right? Yeah, but no. Oh, good old DBZ abridged. DBZ abridged has to be like, like a fifth of the the length of original DBZ, though. It is sixty episodes. How many episodes I agree. is the original? How we get her gimmick. Um, well, we gotta look up to the cell sire because that's when a bridge stops. Everyone has a gimmick. Maybe they're not all good gimmicks. I, I, I'm not sure what mine is yet, but everyone has a gimmick. Let Ellie have her gimmick. I mean, um, yes. I'm, I'm. It's not functionally incorrect. I will be happy to. It's not incorrect. Is a hundred percent incorrect. You, you don't know what is she is or isn't looking level. to. No, you don't know what she is or isn't looking to match with. So, I mean, if you want to match with other content hashtags, hashtag content is the way to use it. If you want to match with other hashtag content, you don't actually do that in a single private chat. I mean, sure, but that's why this isn't functionally incorrect, so, then. Oh, yes. So, then it's not it's, incorrect. It's incorrect on two levels now. No. You're it's not, not incorrect using on the other levels. You're using you, it in the wrong place. You so you are trying to determine someone's gimmick, place. sir. And you don't get to correct style. I'm something style. of an expert on gimmicks. Thank you very much. <laughs> you don't get to correct style. <laughs> what if she right. wants See, my she's gimmick trying to match with other fish. Anyone's gimmick what if she wants to match with other, other fucking fish? And she should she's go trying to match with fish. other fish. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's, that's, that's not for fish. That's... <laughs> That is, that is, that's a common misconception. That's not for act. That's not actually for fish. <laughs> Plenty of farts. Plenty of farts. I'm just saying, you, you don't get to decide other people's gimmicks and other people's taste for them. You can have your taste and that's your gimmicks. That's literally what I get to do. And that's, you get to have your opinion on them, but that's just like your opinion, man. That's that's like 100% what I get to do. That's actually that's that's actually his gim gimmick, Elena, is is judging people for what they I do. Mean, he can judge them all he, he wants, but it doesn't make them factually incorrect. I mean, in this case, it does. No, because yes. you're not you're not deciding what she wants to do with the hashtag. Now I if she was saying <laughs> she's using it wrong. <laughs> this isn't fucking rocket science. I love that me and she's Lollipop are just sitting here. 
I'm I'm just waiting so that I can answer the question of how many Dragon Ball Z episodes there were that's... in comparison to a bridge. I was asked a question. I looked at the answer. I'm just sitting here waiting on a response, and we're we're arguing about we're arguing about the the effectiveness of hashtags. There but was... they're not even effective here, so there can't be anything wrong with it. By the time Dragon Ball Z finished the Cell Games saga, which is where DBZ Abridged has ended, they were on episode 194, and there are 60 episodes in DBZ Abridged. So we're so, so there you go. So it's a solid three to one. Pretty much. Which which basically proves out the meme that like like multiple episodes of DBZ are just to charge up attacks and fights. And talk a lot, yes. Yes. Besides, she communicated, and her communication was heard and understood, so it's not wrong. Now, if she wasn't understood, there could be problems with that. But as long as she's in understood... As long as she is understood, her point was communicated, and thus she's not... Get another redemption here. It's <laughs> uh, a song I wrote for you. I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> I worked really hard on it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, I've killed two of you. <laughs> <laughs> Tom's body counts Watch up to two. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna blow everybody down. If you guys keep this up, we're gonna have to reboot Elena. <laughs> have you tried turning her off and back on again? Are you sure she's plugged in? Well, fortunately, you cannot break <laughs> <laughs> well, sometimes I forget how to breathe when I laugh. Oh, I do that too, and I black out. It's it's really fun, honestly. Like it's it's like a little it's like my own little thrill ride. Like I'll laugh and I'll start laughing so hard that like I'm exhaling and I'm not actually inhaling. So like I block all the oxygen going to my brain for a second, and then I black out. Oh, that just. <laughs> Reminded me of. I'll just, I just say the quote, and you will from, hopefully remember where it's from. Sometimes when I puke, I shit. <laughs> I, don't, I don't get anything so fun like that, Thunder. I just start coughing a lot if it gets bad enough. Oh no, it's great! It's great. Like I'll, 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 uh, like sometimes I'll cough, but sometimes I'll just do the blackout thing. And like what I'll do is, um. Especially if Sabrina's around when I do it, because that's usually when it happens is like when we are like sleepy drunk. You know what you know what I mean? Like you, you've been up way too long, and like everything just mm-hmm. you, you get like punch drunk because you're just so tired. Mm-hmm. And so what we'll do is we'll 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 get we'll get sleep drunk, and then um, we'll start laughing about something, and then I like I'll kind of like I'll I'll start laughing, and w- once I black out, I'll do this thing like this. So that she knows that I'm like blacked out. <laughs> uh. Oh, it's like a whole uh. herd of horses. That's cool. Better than llamas. I'm sorry, I did my best to defend you, Allie, but I was beaten by Tom's song. Uh, I mean, <laughs> and the beanest. Venus, Venus, oh, Venus. Oh yeah, that's that's. Oh yeah, I forgot. That's what defeated you. Tom just defeated me. Like with this, just that's my song. I hope you like it. I worked really hard. I just was dying. Oh, well, we know. We were. We we were. We were, th- we were there. We watched you do it. <laughs> Pixar, it didn't happen. Oh, no pics of me in this state. Hell no. What in what state? Not breathing from laughing like so laughing hard. So hard. Florida. Yes, laughing so hard I'm just crying. Florida. Florida. No, Chris would be sad if I said Florida. No picks in Florida. Oh, I'm okay. I'm far from bed. 
All right, I guess I guess I gotta Zunder go. Underscore far from bed. Underscore <laughs> far from bed. Do do do. I'm I'm going to adore I, the the part where your your name has as many syllables as Spider Man. It's it's just gonna be great. Underscore Spider Man. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen them in the same place together? Once. Okay. <laughs> Yep, I, that's right. You know why? Too many vowels in my name. You know why he's only seen it once? Because everybody gets one. Tell him, Peter. <laughs> Apparently, uh, everybody gets one. Bingo. There are too many vowels in my name. It's from when I was trying to be anonymous on the internet when I was like twelve. Yeah, I've never really tried to be anonymous on the internet because. Um, thankfully I'm a dude and I have that kind of privilege to where I don't have to tr try to be anonymous, but also, um, cause I don't care. I would like to hope you were not as dumb as I was at 12. So <laughs> also that. Oh man. No, 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 no. I was, I was, I was probably that dumb. I, I was probably more that dumb at, uh, at about, oh, 21, 22. Wait, what year was that? See, 25. See, at you wanted to be an adult to be dumb. 12, I really had my shit together. <laughs> at 12, at 12 actually wasn't bad for me. 12, 12, was, 12 was bad for me, but I knew it, I knew better than to use Elon on the internet because it's way too unique. Like, it's not super unique unique, but it, it's still way too identifying. It's, so it's I enough. So I go by Elena, like E-L-A-I-N-A, because -A -A, that's just a normal random name and it was close enough to my name that I'd know someone was talking to me so for a username I switched the I and the E and it's just stuck ever except time. after C correct there's no C's in my name for that Before reason in the there is now <laughs> at 12 I was putting up eBay listings for my dad so you know that doesn't seem sketchy at all <laughs> you know it, that was after he closed his antique store and went to online. <sighs> That's fair. I was 17. I drank some very good beer. In hindsight, I don't know why I didn't just use my middle name of Ellen, but probably because I still hate it. So. Eh, what are you going to do? Um, so, been just as normal. so I, I, I changed the, uh, the, the spawny chamber for the who's a what's it's, it's all dark prismarine oh, now. I like it. Thanks. I got to change um, this last block. Say, can we go up top and make sure that they're still going up there? Oh God. That's, that's water. Oh God. Where, water. where are you? I, I, at my making more warped stem area. Oh, I was about to say but water yeah, is no longer get... a problem here. Water is water is good. When water you get a wet. chance, Zach, yeah, check the check that the squeaky hoozy wetsits are still going up because every once in a while, when we edit the outside blocks, it screws up the source blocking for some reason. Okay. I'm actually gonna head over there and fix my stuff a little bit, and I'll just check while I'm there. Do, do, do. Well, I'm I'm heading up there now, just to be sure. I've been on computers since before, or since I could be. Like, that was the only way for me to talk to my dad throughout the week because we would send email. There's a and, there's uh, Hoozy What's It's up there. Yep, there's Squeaky Hoozy What's It, so it's still working, successful. And yeah, computers were just always my thing. I mean, I think I think we all know me, and you know by now we all no, know that computers were my thing. Never, they were never your thing. Computer, you hate them. That's the first real. Like, those are not mutually exclusive. <laughs> <laughs> they can be my thing, and I can also hate them. This is fair. They're his thing because he hates them. No, I hate them because they're my thing, see. I think we're saying the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> Frog protection? 
You're totally saying I the same thing. I don't think we need more stall, more stone. So I'm gonna leave stone in a checkpoint chest. Good lord, this thing spawns so many fucking guardians. Like it's like Guardian City over here. My mom is trying to call Ooh. me. No, mom, I'm streaming. Hi, Zunder mom. Are you doing that internet thing again? Listen, I'm not I'm actually Nintendo. mocking your mom. I'm just assuming all moms are are assumption of internet thing. No, my mom streams about as much as I do, actually. That's fair. She, but she does it on Facebook, what? and it's all like crafting oh. shit. But my mom absolutely has a like a Facebook page where she she does fucking crafts. Like it's, I'm just kind of like, huh, okay, freaking sure, mom. Do you ever go and ask her for advice on how to get followers? No. Son of a bitch. She has she has a very vastly different audience than I do. That's fair. Besides, she has like a thousand Facebook friends, like literally. So, I'm see about Facebook, I have like. See, Sydney watches her streams. Facebook. If I get over like a hundred friends, I start feeling like I don't know them. Oh, I I I know everyone. That's my. That's my curse in life, you see. I, I just know everyone. Um, my best friend growing up... the best day ever. Huh? My best friend growing up, he, uh, he always said that he hated going back home to visit with me. Not that he, like, didn't enjoy hanging out, but it was like... He, he told me once, he's like, we could go into a building with five people, and ten people would stop to talk to you. Oh my god, this the suitcase. Should I call my mom on stream? Would that be would that be weird? It would be quality content. Oh. Uh. I mean, is anything we do normal? I literally just died of laughter because Tom was telling me I was wrong. Well, no, he you died of laughter because of his amazing song and the feedback that he that he requested on it. <laughs> this is true. And just the very deadpan way. Yeah, that's It was it was it was the full presentation really. Well, comedy is about timing and delivery. Like it's that's those are mm -hmm. the the key tenets of of comedy. So, you know. I am the consummate showman. You are, it's true. Like if if anything, Tom 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 knows how he knows what the people want. And it's fish content. You just try not, not to give it to hashtags. them because they don't deserve it. Right. What makes them so great? No, I would let her know that she's that she's on stream. But, you know, Maybe have a collaborative where you would try to attempt to follow her instructions for craft. No. And either succeed or fail horribly. <laughs> and the failing horribly would be hilarious. Good answer. <laughs> I'm just saying. I would be amused at watching Zach trying to craft something with Zundermom. I mean, I'm damn good at it. I get it. I get it from her. Okay, that's fair. Oh yeah, no, I'm I can craft with the best of them. I am not crafty. Or if or even when I am, I am Get out of here. The amount of soldering irons I've burnt myself on is too damn high. Get out of here. Like, 
Get I, gone I now. I concerned my uh, my GP my last yeah. visit or not my last visit but the visit before because I had a giant <clears throat> like bliss, burn blister in my arm and she's like, "Are you okay? What's that from?" I'm like, "Yeah, I, I rammed my arm into the other side." She's like, "What?" And I'm like, "I was moving cookies and I lifted my arm too much and ran it straight into the heating element." And she's like, "You're not supposed to do that." I know. Thanks. That's what like three other scars on my armor for. So I'm probably gonna do it again at some point. Thanks, Doc. That's eight hundred dollars. Yeah, I paid. I paid you a. I, I paid you a seventy-five fucking dollar copay to tell me a thing that I already fucking knew. But thanks. <laughs> I mean, no, I was just there for my general visit, but she was, you know, being a good doctor and being concerned about, you know, abnormalities. And I'm just like, no, that's unfortunately Hello. just normal for me. Stone works. Nice. Yeah, Sydney, I'm. Uh, I. When I moved here, I knew two people. Like, literally, two people when I first moved here. Um, I moved here at the very end of June in 2008. Um, and the people that I knew, um, I had met because they actually had friends in my hometown. Um, so they came to visit the friends. Uh, I was working at the bowling alley in my hometown at the time. Um, and so I met them when they came out to hang out bowling one night. Uh, and so I just, one day, like I decided that I had to leave my hometown and that's what I did. I, I basically picked a spot on the map and this was it. And like, it's uh, awfully unsafe for me to be out here. I uh, two people when we moved down here, and now they're gone. Yeah, your 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 brother and sister in law. Yep. Yep. And now they're back in Ohio. Well, see, it's like an even trade. See, like you have to you have to maintain the delicate balance between Florida and Ohio. My only issue with that is I don't want people to live in Ohio. They shouldn't be forced to live like that. I mean, Florida's not much better. It's just warmer. It's warmer. That makes it better. A lot better. Well, you say that until you're that. until you're somebody like me, you know, who all, runs hot all the time anyway. Exactly. I, I forget. You haven't met me. I am basically a space heater. Oh, yeah. Summer is hell, but I will still just... I will take Florida over Ohio any day. No, I walk I walk outside like like the one day a year it gets down to like 40 degrees. I walk outside in just my house shorts and I'm like, how about this fucking weather? And I just bask in it. It's the best thing ever. But yeah, Four I'm... Four years... Five years later, my blood is finally starting to thin into getting slightly chilly sometimes. Finally. I was concerned I was going to be one of those people whose blood never thinned out because we have a couple of, like online friends who didn't. I was just like, no, I don't want that to be me. No. But I'm never going to be, I'm never going to be like loving 80 degrees. It's never going to happen. Yeah, no, 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 no. Like, especially trying to sleep. Because I can't sleep without a blanket, either. So See, that's the that's thing. Fun time. I, I can't sleep without a blanket, but I also get hot. So, like, I have to have a lot of, lot of cooling and moving air around me when I sleep. Yep. So, yeah. I know someone like that. Hey, so do I. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, it's Hallie, a, that's, it's that, is, game. that is something that you have to be very careful about saying aloud. Oh Ooh, boy! In chat, what'd you say? And typing in chat. And although I don't, there's no auto mod here, but yeah, the letters are close together on the keyboard. No, I don't. I don't have like, auto mod. Aren't they not anywhere near it? Uh, you have me, who is basically auto mod. It's true. Well, we're we're not busy enough yet to to need auto mod, which is which I'm thankful for. You know, in a roundabout way. Hmm. 
Would I like the traffic to need auto mod? Absolutely. <clears throat> but yeah, be great. <laughs> You'll get there. I mean, heck, you're you're up a few followers from last stream, if I remember correctly. I am. I'm up to 79 now, which I'm very happy about. I really wanna like. I really uh, wanna hit 100 by the end of March. Darkness. I'm seeing as March hasn't even started yet. Yeah, I know. Um, but <clears throat> that's still that's still a very lofty goal. It's lofty, but I don't know. It's not impossible. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me go get in the old bed Rooney. <laughs> bed is too far away. I measure I measure whiskey by the glass, personally. <clears throat> Hey, um, oh, there we go. hey, Elena, let me ask you something. So uh -huh. the way that you're framing the outside of this here, <clears throat> uh -huh. do you want the bricks all the way around the perimeter and also like the regular prismarine above it so that like the entire perimeter looks like this with prismarine and then also the layer of bricks? Yeah, I was going to do that, because that's going to partially be how I do the sea lantern layout. Okay. Because I was initially thinking of matching the top with the, the, the light and dark prismarine, but that's uh, way too many ink snaps. I ain't doing that. Or if I do it, it'll be later. I'll start with regular prismarine and replace it later when I have 8 million and 2 ink snaps. Okay. Then I am going to go ahead and do this around the perimeter while I have... The extra prismarine and blocks you. on me, or bricks rather, on me. I appreciate you. Sure. Because yeah, that's that's I if you you can see the one section where I see lantern, and so that's what I was kind of prototyping out. So let me ask you this: you have I see some of the places on the edges where you have sea lanterns. Is that a thing that's going to stay, uh -huh. or do you? No, those are going to move in one. Okay, I can so I can do that. In one so that all the lighting is gonna be invisible. Got it. I I hadn't decided. So you're what you're seeing is me doing like three different things and going. Mm. But you're prototyping. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah, <clears throat> that's what we we all do. Use the measure a shot and a half shot. Oh, the golf course. That's where you met Andrew. Avid golfer? Huh? Avid golfer? Uh, yeah. wait. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, shit. Hmm. Oh. Did you uh, just put one in the... No, 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 no. It's not that. It's the the back side is different because the columns are off by one. For whatever reason, the columns are in weird spots. Wait, what do you mean? So, like, if off you by one. if you look here, you can see on the corner here where the column on the one side it ends flush with the the um, yes. the top. Um. Yes, unfortunately, it's just going to have to be the column is whatever it is. Um, the columns were not symmetrical, so I made the platform symmetrical because I refused to make an unsymmetrical platform. Uh, nope, that's... So it's not going to be flush. It's not going to be symmetrical with the columns, but that oh, is the okay, price okay. I've accepted. No, it that's... was like 15 on one side and 14 on the other, and I was like, uh... <laughs> So then let me ask you this. Because that kind of changes the layout here a little bit with the lanterns. Um, so we have... There we go. He came to drink and drive the golf cart. He gets that from his sister. Mostly the driving the golf cart part. So we have the sea lanterns here. And I moved... Here, I'll show you on this side just so you can see. So see how on this mm -hmm. one side they're offset, so they're staggered. Mm -hmm. But on the other side, I moved the one in already. Should I just move that back out now? Because the the prismarine mm -hmm. on the top is going to come out here. 
Honestly, to take that second one down, and it's probably just... I'll probably just change the pattern to only one. Probably. Or, oh, you have room to put it offset without it being on the outside. Right, right, right. Whoa, whoa! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, off, well, yeah that happens sometimes. Oh, okay. <laughs> just sync, and it'll eventually work again. Huh. <laughs> there you go. All right. <laughs> So, yeah, if you have room to offset it out without it being on the outside, then yeah. But, like I said, there the lighting is not 100%. I hadn't figured out. And eventually it'll be hidden, so it doesn't really matter where it is. Because eventually it'll just be slabbed in. Okay. It's magically lighting the place. It's magical. Yep. Okay. Okay, then that's where... Okay. So, we have this... <clears throat> Um, in our bedroom, like on hanging on the wall near the bed, Sabrina ha on on her side of the bed, she has this this picture frame that's got three pictures in it. One of them is her brother in his um, like his his Air Force photo, like his official photo. Uh, one of them is she and I uh, at Disney, um, and then one is literally her driving a golf cart and looking like she's having the best fucking time she's ever had in her entire goddamn life. And that's it. I don't it. want to drive anything. Golf carts probably are like forklifts to me. And I'm, nope. I'm disappointed oh. that you didn't go with uh, you and your Excel shirt in front of the green screen. Oh, no, that one's hanging up in the, like, we have a, a big collage of pictures in the living room and that one's up at the top. So I have a micro. I have a set of Microsoft Office shirts. Oh fuck! It's going to be off on this side too. Do you do you want it? Do you want it jutted out on like the two sides where it's off? Yeah. Okay. Well, I'll I'll go through and fix that then. Um. So my Sorry. no no it's okay it's okay I would I would rather it be like the way that you want it. Um, so, yeah, you had to just angle it. hey, whatever works, right? Mm -hmm. Um, so anyway, the three office shirts that I have are, um, I have a shirt, a gray t-shirt that says, uh, running for office with the, the Microsoft office logo. Uh, I have one that says, uh, that has the word logo and says up. So word up. And then I have my Excel shirt that says, I simply Excel, or I simply, and it has the Excel logo. So, of course, it's Excel, so Elon, being, being the spreadsheet enthusiast that you are, you know what Excel's primary accent color is. Green. It's green. So, uh, Sabrina and I went on a cruise once, and... They have the the photos that you take as you board the boat, and so you know you can pay like the seventy three thousand dollars or whatever it is for one shitty photo. Um, and so we have our embarkation picture, and the the couple of times that she and I had I had been on a cruise once, um, and she had been on like a couple of cruises, but the cruises that we had been on, the um. The backdrops for the embarkation photo were actual, like, photograph backdrops. For this one, it was not. And, of course, we didn't know that going into it. So, um, there was a green screen. And I'm wearing my very green Excel shirt that very, very much matches the chroma key green that's on the backdrop. So we take the picture, we get on the boat, we do our thing, yada, yada. So we go like the next day to go look at the pictures to say, okay, Hey, here's this, here's this photo that we have. And dollar picture, right? Our $73,000 picture. And what do we see? We see Sabrina standing. I have an arm over her shoulder. 
Uh, and then my head is floating on top of the boat, like over top of the boat. <laughs> my head is f- literally floating over the top of the fucking boat because it chroma key. They chroma keyed in the actual boat itself, and that was it. And it matched. So we're like, we see this thing, and immediately, like, I look at Sabrina and she looks at me, and we're both like. We have to fucking buy this photo. Like, when when will we ever get a chance like this again? Like, we we you never know. So we went to the we took the photo up to the register, where the guy that was working the register was like selling people their pictures, and he he looks at it and he looks at us and he's like, "We can fix it. Do you want us to fix it?" And we look at him and we're like, "We're like, there's nothing to fix." This is perfection. We want it because it's broken. <laughs> this is, it's not Stop broken. It. <laughs> Working as intended. Working as coded is my favorite. What was that? Working as coded. Working as coded. That's exactly what happened. So, yeah. So we bought that picture and it hangs in our living room at the top of this collage of all of our other pictures uh, that we have in there. And it's just fantastic. I mean, it probably made the cruise people a sale because, I mean, I don't know about you, but like half those pictures come out boring. So, like, your average picture you may or may not have bought, but that, like, absolutely. Oh, yeah. Like, like how many people can say that they have a picture like that, you know? Like, just, just amazing. Just fantastic. In fact, I might pull it up in a second. I might see if I can find it in a second to show because it's just that good. Um, okay, so it looks like perimeter's oh, done. Yeah, like you've done amazing work. Pillar's done. Uh, we've got the... We're all cleaned up down here. Uh, I know the belly's, the belly's finished because I finished that. Bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, there's a couple. Um, if you look at the pillars, it looks like I left like the last stone block. Yeah, I see that. And, and there's a stone stripe on one of them. So maybe those, but. Let's go down here and. Listen here, fucky fuck face. I do not have time for your shit. I don't have the patience for you. Get fucked. Oh, look. It's fucky fuck Literally shit junior. There's nothing but time for their shit. I know, but they don't need to know that. Then they're just going to come back and give me more shit. It sounds anyway. like hmm noises, Chris. What's wrong? Be Somebody is fish. on my map. What? It ain't me. Wait, what map? Filling in my map. What? Where are you? On my map. He's he's on the map. It, <laughs> I don't boy. I don't I don't think he can make this any clearer. He is literally on the map. What coordinates are your map? He's mapping it up, map style. Hi. Up a mapping Hi. style. <laughs> are you are you below me? Yes. Would you like me to come up and say hi? Nah. I'm at 1638-2498 right now. I mean, if you're still hurting for food, you can come up here and get food. I have 28 beef. I could come up there and trade you a bunch of ore for beef. If sure. You so care kindly offer me food. I don't know if you are carrying enough food to offer me food. I am. All right. Digging my way up top. Digging fast. Paces pass. And I'm stone bound. Dirt bound, actually. No, right now it's stone. She will gladly pay you Tuesday for a hamburger today. Heck no. I ain't paying him till next week. I don't get paid on Tuesday. I think I'm the only one 
Well, I say that with Tom in the room. It's quoted in WoW. I was going to say, it's quoted in WoW, so you're not the only one. Oh, okay. I probably don't know the original reference. Mm. It's nighttime, and there's raiders up here. Hold on. Unless the original reference is MASH or something. Don't ask me why who's watched almost nothing in my life would actually know a couple of MASH references. Listen, if there are references to know, especially with Tom in the room, MASH is the fucking thing to know, friend. Let me tell you. What's up there? Boy, howdy. Like, getting that is... Attacked now? You're getting attacked? Yeah. Uh... Uh -oh. It's going to be a minute to sleep then. I'm back in bed. Okay, I will just log out. Okay. The people who hey, we're are good. In spots to bed, Ooh. bed. Do the bedding. All right, let's. Hopefully not. Let's do final inspection. Spot. All right, we're gonna do the outside perimeter. Uh, why did they? Why did they have to make them even and not? I guess. To fit into a chunk, but to, into chunks, but still. The real question is why isn't a chunk fifteen blocks? Because because com computers don't count that way. They'll do what you tell them. Yeah, because fifteen isn't is a isn't chunk. Yeah, it's it's not chunky enough. Seventeen would be chunky enough. Yeah. Yeah, but then. The, uh, God damn it. Why does that always happen? <sighs> oh, right. That's what I was about to do. Yep, 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 yep. Hey, where am I? What am I... Where am I and what am I doing? Is this... No, this is not out. God, I get so oh. turned around in these places. Ooh. I need to put up signs. What? I think you're in the back. Yeah, I think so I too. Aha! All right, let's let's go back to inspection over here. I had a column with some stone oh. on it. What's oh? Parkour incorrectly. Thank you, sir. No, 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 take it down again. Oh. That sounded. That sounded very. What's, Thanks. what's the word I'm thinking of? You fucked up. It's all fixed. Alright. Bye. 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 Have a great time. Transaction is complete. I appreciate <laughs> your beef for clearing out my shulker box. The, the mold didn't see your shadow. No, just, no six weeks of winter. Is it freezing anymore? <laughs> nope, you took it for granted. And by the, with him taking it, the ore will get home sooner. Because, let's be real, how often do I go home? Do you even know? Well, <laughs> go to your home. Are you too good for your home? <laughs> Kinda, yeah. I mean, not too good, but I just am never there. Never there. You're never there. You're never, ever, ever. Oh, sorry. Sometimes, sometimes. It's hard on it. It's okay. Sometimes there's, sometimes there's cake, you know. <laughs> what attacked you? Are you okay? I'm fine. Nothing attacked me. Just boom. There was this whole thing. It was this whole yeah, thing. In there. Boom. That's all. 
boom. Yes. Like a, a boom boom. boom. Mm-hmm. So a boom like boom, a boom tried boom to boom or a click click boom. Hey, little fella, are you lost? Me. Yeah, you're fucking I, lost. And then it exploded. Hey, fuck you. We, we all heard it. You heard it here first, folks. Some eeping. Have fun storming the castle. Whee. Our friends. When you're having fun, you, ref you refer to yourself and some other people. Yes, our friend Savannah will say that, especially to her husband. Like anytime, like he he walks off to do a thing, she'll just go have fun storming the castle. Oh, I miss them. I miss people. I uh, I do too. Their friend, I sure do. That's that is literally the reason I started doing this. Like that was the deciding factor was I missed people and I missed interacting with other humans. And so I thought, you know, I've been wanting to to get back into to broadcast for a while. Like I was thinking for a while about starting a podcast about something which, you know, thanks to the stream I actually have an idea. The Golden Girls Cinematic Universe. Um but like that was that was the the driving factor that was the thing that made me ultimately decide to do this was wanting to like actually interact with humans like there are people I don't miss but I do miss people as I'm just telling one of my coworkers who I haven't seen in the whole year like I miss water breaks she was the one who dragged me off for water breaks and talked to me yeah, like I would be the one to go over. So the developers, we all live in one area. Well, we did anyway, you know, before it was decided that we could just work from home forever, which, not going to lie, I, I enjoy. Um, but the developers, we all sat in one place, and then, like, on the opposite corner of the building is where the rest of our team, like the non-dev part of the team was. So, like... Our product owner, our business analyst. So I would just like, I would just get up and I'd be like, I would just go and hang out at the product owner's desk, be like, hey, what are you doing? Want to go get a chicken sandwich at Mel's? Because she's she doesn't like hot dogs. Stuff. And then we would we would all go to Mel's and we would have a grand old time, and it was I'm great. Like, I, I, I can't. I can't Mills. complain too much because I still work with people every other week, but it's only half of the people and it's only every other week. And I'm just like, you also don't like many of those people. Uh, yes, that's true. I do work with pizzas late and suffer fools. So, well, the, the other, the, those are both nicknames with stories, by the way. <laughs> oh no, I'm, I'm, I'm sure. I do not doubt it. Well, the other thing is like, even if I were in the office right now, like it's not the same, like, you can't just like safely walk up to someone's desk now and just like hang out and have a conversation because it's like, mm, who knows? Maybe maybe I'll come home with a potentially deadly virus. Maybe I won't. Who knows? Let's have the wait. No, that's not fun. <laughs> nope. Those are the kind of statements that you uh, you bring out the prices right thing before you start saying them. <laughs> oh no, that's that's less of a theme and. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're doing split weeks, so half of us work one week and half of us work the other week. And for the first while, uh, there were only a very few of us who were working from home. Um, the rest were just paid for their time off because it was considered a uh, safety thing the company was putting in place it was a disaster recovery because if someone got sick on the one of the weeks they could uh do a deep clean and bring the other week in and still function they were worried about a site going down entirely um they finally given us enough supplies so actually most of both weeks are working from home for a couple hours every day but so we haven't i haven't talked to most of them 
even like digitally for most of the time. I've talked to a couple of them and I've talked to a couple of them regularly, but otherwise like that's it. And I've one I'm one of the only ones who actually like worked from home, so it's even worse for some of the others. It's gotten to the point so. with us where like we have our product owner on days that she's out, I just fill in for her. Like so, you know, they you you almost can't tell that she's gone cuz I I I sound just like her just, you know, with a a deeper voice. And we uh we told her about this what last week was it Lollipop? Mhm. And she lost her shit like she was crying, she was laughing so hard. Not unlike uh, Elena earlier tonight when Tom you know, solicited feedback on his latest musical ditty. <laughs> it's a very Tom mixtape. musical ditty. <laughs> You're wrong. It's just a very Tom. Boy, you Tom have no Tom's idea. Great. Oh, that reminds me. So I tweeted about it um, this morning, but man. So, like, Target is doing this, like, Target Con thing where they have a bunch of toys coming out. And... Um, like one of the big things was like a bunch of Funko pops that were coming out as part of it. And they had like this deluxe Skeletor sitting on his throne, which just like, I saw that and I'm like, Holy fuck. So I immediately went to the target website and of course they were sold out. And I'm like, man, I'm like, you know, that's as they should be, uh, as they should be. But like, I, it was utterly disappointing. Cause if there is anything like, I know at this point Tom has his fill of Funko Pops. Like he's he's got enough to be buried in them, quite literally. Um, mm-hmm. But man, if there has ever been one that is just like got Tom's name all fucking over it, it is Skeletor sitting on his throne. Yep. Like holy fuck. However, I was gifted a giant Skeletor Funko Pop. By Allie for Christmas. That's because she's a very good Allie. Mm-hmm. Like that it was very Kitterino of her. It was incredibly Kitterino of her. But she knows what you like. I hope so. I mean, by this point, you know, you would think she would. Mm-hmm. Yeah, unlike some people who are incredibly hard to buy for. Huh? I don't know anybody like that. Yes, you do. I don't know anybody like that. You know lo- yes, you do. No, I don't. You know Lollipop. Yes, you do. You know Lollipop. I don't know anybody like that. and I don't know anybody else like yes, that. Yes, you and- do. I, that I'm not saying, but you know Lollipop, and he is incredibly hard to buy for. See, Sabrina gets... she she. I'm, I am also incredibly hard to buy for. And, like, the biggest problem with, like, buying stuff for me is, one, I I don't really like having stuff bought for me. But also, like, I just, if I want something, I just go get it. And then I have it. Okay, see, the second one I'm used to dealing with, because that's, that's the Chris thing, is if he wants something, he gets it, or we've, we've already budgeted it for it. But the first one, as, as someone whose love language is gifts, that, that one's, like, foreign to me. See, I'm the same way. Like, if, like if, I'm, if, I, if I care about you, I will buy you shit. Whether it's, like, actual stuff, or if it's food... Like whatever, that's that's my thing, man. I'm I'm all about like like getting stuff for people. That's surprising because for me it's the same. Like I am incredibly on board to buy gifts, but like the the fastest way to my heart like is getting me a well thought gift. Like it's not like a get me everything in the world, but get like our chocolate. You can't go wrong with chocolate. Well, yes, but like Ooh, a well thought gift more is just into like my ear, lollipop. <laughs> <laughs> more things into your ear, lollipop. Yeah. <laughs> well, well met. Uh, oh, I need to. 
I need to go Almost upstairs. <laughs> I need to go upstairs. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, oh, there you go. wait, wait, wait. These are. <laughs> but no, for real, just buy your chocolate. You can't go wrong with chocolate. Yes and no. Like, I am trying to eat better, so you can kind of go wrong with chocolate these days. Yeah, chocolate is... You have to buy it. It's... it's, it's it, what that means is that you... It, it is now um, less expensive. Eh? Is there an because inner chest up here somewhere? It's, it's, uh, no. There used to be, but it was mine, so I took it. We need one for over there. Oh, okay. Um, no, take this as me actually telling you, like, there are, there are occasions that works for, aka Valentine's Day, because that is basically just free chocolate day, but, um, no, not so much, not anymore. Like, I've actually been finding, like, I like chocolate a lot still, but I like it less than I used to. It's weird. Can puzzles me. Huh. I'm still confused by this. I mean, I still can find other things for you pretty, pretty easily. See, that's what that's. I mean, yeah, I, uh, Allie, that's the way I am. Like, like I just, I don't. I'm, I'm very bad at receiving gifts, and also I feel like I don't, I don't like. I shouldn't be getting gifts. Like, there's, there's no reason I should be getting a gift. Like, there's, there's nothing that I've done to warrant me receiving a gift. You exist. Yeah, that's you that's exist. no, that's no. No, no, that's <laughs> don't give me that horse shit. No. Does does anyone else have to earn earn warranting gifts from you? No. Well, I mean, no. Like, just there's just so if it's somebody if I care about. They don't have to earn them from you. If if they don't have to earn them from you, then why why would you have to earn them from them? Because because I don't make the just rules. Just give them the gift of of craze and break. <laughs> All right, I'll take the I will take the gift of craze and break. I'm down for that. <laughs> All right. Um, Lollipop, getting you out of this conversation. All right. Um, do you have a choice or dealer's dealer's choice? Dealer's choice. All right. I'm doing. Uh, I'm doing classic again. I like the classic. No, I just. I feel it's it's different. Like I don't make the rules; those are just the way the rules exist. I'm I'm just I'm just letting you know. The rules might not be what you think they are. Listen, you know the rules. You and might so be harder I. on yourself so than you I. should be. <laughs> From one harder on on yourself than they should be to another person, it doesn't always work like we think it does. I'm just saying, you wouldn't get this from any other guy. I'm I'm pretty sure Elena just pulled the. You don't think it'd be like that. But it do. But it do. I'm just saying I've had some very persuasive people try to persuade me that I can I can get gifts. So. Hmm. Damn right. Cause I'm, I, I've always liked the gifts, but I've always been like, but, 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 but why? And and Chris has like ever so slowly like nudged that out of me. Mm. Next time on Zunder Therapy. Mm-hmm. I mean, <laughs> so like Sabrina, Sabrina will get me little things. Um. And again, incredibly rarely, because it's just like, you know, not my thing to to get stuff. Like I just, I, I again, I'm I'm a lot like Ali. I feel incredibly awkward receiving gifts. Um, so she will typically get me small things, and she's she's really good. Like I'm I'm again I'm difficult to shop for, but she's you know she's always good at that kind of stuff. Um. You know, we're just going to, I'll just do it the old fashioned way. Um, but, 
she did have like a big one that she did a couple of years ago in like man let me tell you it was it was her some of her finest work um tom actually got involved with that one um as just as a consultation because you know she, whenever you know you plan something big like that you you want to make sure that you're you're getting it right so that you you know that you don't inadvertently get the wrong thing or if it's not exactly the right thing especially if it's not your area of expertise um but uh she she had bought me a um a special edition 3ds so a few years ago nintendo made a special edition um a special metroid edition 3ds which they haven't made metroid shit because like metroid is like basically one one above the on the list of uh forgotten fucking ips just above Star Fox. sorry tom bastards um but i mean other than that like metroid is basically done like they don't they don't fucking like we've been waiting for metroid prime 4 for like 18 years or whatever i don't know not really but you get my point oh sleep. oh sleep i can sleep so Sabrina went and like pre-ordered it, which it's one of those Nintendo things where they don't make enough of them. Y'all can come back. Um, they never make enough. So, you know, it sells out immediately. It actually didn't quite sell out immediately because they actually made enough of them. So she was able to snag one. But then the unprecedented thing happened where they came back in stock. And this is where me, the asshole, comes into play. So I went and I'm like, I saw that they had them in stock. And I'm like, oh, fuck, I'm going to get one. And Sabrina's like, no, you don't need to get one. Like, it's fine. You know, just don't worry about it. You'll, you'll, you can get it later. Like, you're not going to play it now. Blah, blah, blah. Like, she was coming. She was trying her damnedest, bless her, to, to come up with reasons why I shouldn't get one. And finally, like, after hemming and hawing on it, I finally was like, nope, nope, I'm going to go fucking get one. And, like, I was about to leave the house and go to, like, the Target or whatever to go pick one up or the GameStop or something. And she's like, get in the goddamn house. She's like, it'll be here on fucking Tuesday. I'm like, what? And she's like... I already fucking bought it for you. And this was like in September. So she was getting it as like a, a Christmas present. And she was going to give it to me early, yeah. but still. You ruined it, you impatient dick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we don't... It, he can surprise me, but I know better than to try and surprise Chris with anything tech, techy. So it's just if uh, if I tell you about it early, don't expect anything big for whatever I was planning it for, kind of thing. Yeah. Because I don't, I know that w that exact th scenario will happen. <laughs> like if if anything, the best surprise, the best way I can surprise him is like whatever day it comes out, I I bring it home. Like I think I did that to him with the uh, Nintendo Wii U. Oh, yeah. I don't remember. You There's flew also, like a bat out of hell to get a Switch. I, I, yes, I did. And a Switch we did, ended up not needing, but, you know, that's because we're dumb and forgot we pre-ordered things. <laughs> Wait, so you went out to buy we a Switch that you forgot from, that you pre-ordered? We pre-ordered through Target, and I guess I, I never got the emails about it, and they didn't come out, like, the day they were released. And so I guess I totally forgot about it, and I assumed it would have had, like emailed me by the time that they were being released. <laughs> um, so we had realized that we didn't have a switch, and we were like, uh, and then we we're like, okay, we really want one, but they were selling like hotcakes, and so I spent. And please note, because I think you've heard this, I hate phone calls. On my way home from work that day, I called like three or four best buys and the one on candy maybe 
somewhere in Tampa ish. I don't hmm. remember. I'd know it if I heard it, but I don't remember. That narrows that it down. They had like I don't know some of some less than double digit number of them. Obviously, isn't going to hold them because <laughs> why would you? So I <laughs> because fuck you. That's why. From Saint Petersburg, I like immediately pulled it up in uh my GPS and drove like a bat out of hell from Saint Petersburg to there, and by the time I got through the line waiting for them to them after me there were two and then it had like two or three weirdos del mabry may del damn may del mabry mabry del, del mabry words del mabry That's i got it. it was um and uh i'm walking out of the store like adrenaline rushed from having driven across the thing because a i don't like phone calls b i don't like driving c i really don't like driving in places i don't know so all of that was zero fun for me and uh then this guy's like trying to walk up to me as i'm trying to walk out of the store and i'm just like nope 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 i don't know what you want i don't know who you are just nope i'm getting in my car i'm running away nope <laughs> so that's my getting Chris a Switch story. And then like a week later, the other the one we'd pre-ordered arrived, you know. The one yeah, that showed up, but in the time that it had taken that one to show up, the original one that we got bricked like 3 days later and we had to go find another one. And we found another one at another Best Buy and they warranty exchanged it for us. Oh, well, that's good at least. It was like an hour away that one. But yeah, that was that was And I had to restart Breath of the Wild. Fucking stupid. That was cuz cuz cloud saves weren't a thing yet and that's stupid. <laughs> meanwhile, but, yeah, meanwhile Tom and I are over here playing our Xboxes. Our cloud saves are for like Halo and shit are importing from the fucking 360. <laughs> yeah, like that 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 whole thing was a whole lot of dumb. I'm just really thankful we were able to sell for retail price the second one because I was really upset because at the time we did not need two switches at all. Yeah, that... did not need to spend on two switches. <laughs> yeah, the guy I worked for couldn't get his hands on one and he had two sons. So he was like, I really want to switch. And I was like, well, I have two. <laughs> <laughs> How how bad do you want it, old I man? Two and you're the. I have two, and you're the owner of my company, so I know you have money. Can we? Uh, how about we work this out? Let's. Yeah, let's. I didn't get a switch at launch. I I wasn't interested at first. I yeah, I didn't either. I I was. It was. It was a while before we got ours. Um, actually. Yeah, I want to say it was probably about a, a year plus after launch because. I th I think I don't I don't think I got mine. No, I know I didn't get mine uh or our first one, the one that's in here with me until uh Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee came out. That's when I was like, okay, they remade like they re-remade first gen. Fuck it, I'm getting them. I, that's it. I'm like that's how you get me to that's how you get my fucking money is you re-release um gen 1 Pokémon games. Done. Fine. Shut up and take my money. Yeah, Zelda is is we're we're pretty much always on board with release of uh, Switch consoles. If it wasn't for you, there's no way we would have bothered with the Xbox. We normally wait at least a year, year and a half for Xbox, if not longer, and about the same. But we we normally get the PlayStation, and then we normally skip Xbox. Oh, well, it. What I've found is, especially since I've started getting into PC gaming, is that the Nintendo, whatever Nintendo's current console is, tends to be a good, um, it, it, I mean, outside of, you know, the first party Nintendo titles that everyone knows and loves, um, it's been a very good supplemental console for someone who PC games primarily. So, like, I've always just picked up like ever since the Wii I've just always picked up whatever Nintendo's selling at that point yeah and um when I was more of a console gamer at the time 
um, I had an Xbox, and then I had because I had never really been um, a PlayStation owner ever. Like I think the first PlayStation that I owned was this PS4 or the PS3 that yeah. I totally could have just walked into a GameStop and not bought. Yeah. Oh boy, mm-hmm. I feel like this is another wallet story. Oh, this is just the story that we were bored, and I don't remember why we were waiting in that parking lot for whatever. And so we were both bored, and in this parking lot for like it had a Walmart and a GameStop and a Chipotle, and we were trying to kill time for something. I don't remember for the life of me what. And so we're just bored in the car, and Chris is like why don't we go into GameStop? And I'm like, because we're trying not to spend money because we're trying to move to Florida. And he's like, we can totally walk into GameStop and look around and not spend money. And we walked out with a PS3. <laughs> you and walk out with a console. Like, multiple games for the PS3. Well, you fell for that, huh? I mean, it was mostly his money. He made me, so. That's like, oh, for the love of God. <laughs> what? Wandering trader with llamas is inside of Trader Tom's. <laughs> Uh, I just, I just came down from upstairs. And he I has landed squares. On him. If you have emerald, he's about to have sword marks in his face. <laughs> if you wait long enough, he'll leave. If you if you kill the wandering trader with the other villagers there, do they get pissy with you about it? And... No, they don't give a shit. Okay, so it's just like if you kill one of their he's own. Not one of them. Well, I mean, they don't care if you kill one of them. Like, no, Tom Tom retires one of them, and they just turn around and go, huh? huh. Well, they, they don't want to be retired. They do not care in bedrock. Oh, they do care in Java. Oh, it's almost like, yes. it's almost like there's an improved villager mechanic in bedrock. Well, uh, I wouldn't go that far. You cannot walk into the Lego store and not walk out with Legos. That's that is physically Actually, impossible. No. Oh, I can do it. I have. We to have do zero it. Legos. How, how, when's the last time you've been into a Lego store? I don't know. Have you ever been into uh, a Lego store? Know. Yes. It was a few years ago. Okay. I think the last time that I went into a Lego store was actually. For the Feast of Tom, several years ago, when Tom and I, Tom and I went, it was like, it was Zach and Tom's Excellent Adventure, and we went to Downtown Disney, and they have a Lego store there, so we went to the Lego store, and then we went and we had lunch at this Irish pub that's there, and it was great. It's that Irish. was, huh? Because Irish, because Irish, right, right. And boy, howdy, that was just a fantastic day. That day was top notch. That was a good day. That was the day that I bought my Back to the Future DeLorean. That's actually, it's up on the shelf up there, I think. Oh, well, no, maybe that one's not on the shelf. Uh, It might be. I can't tell. That's very up there, and I'm very sitting in the chair right now. I, uh... Yeah, like the minifigs, yeah. Last time that I was in a Lego store, I did not buy anything while I was there because I had spent all the money I had budgeted on that trip on this um, Beauty and the Beast. I think it's a music box. Yes, it's a music and light-up box if we actually charge batteries and put them in it. Because I went to... um, California for uh, my brother's friend's wedding and he lives right by Disneyland it did yes but we didn't go actually into the park it was like their Disneyland's version of the city walk uh. and um, there's a Lego store there so I did look around at the Lego store and I did throw Lego pieces at my mom, but it, there was no, there was no Lego per hasing on that day. You little shit! You threw Legos went, at your mom. I mean, you little ingrate. Listen, and, she probably deserved it. That's not the point. But he did. He he did the awesomes and got the awesome gift instead. 
So Which I'm totally not expecting. So then, so I don't think we've talked about like Disney related stuff. So where 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 do you fall on? I I mean I'm assuming that you know you fall somewhere on the Disney fandom spectrum. Then Elena. Um. See, here's the thing. I've never been to Disney. I've never been on a Disney anything. Um. I like Beauty and the Beast. A good chunk of the others are hit or miss. Okay. I like a lot of the soundtracks. But okay. Beauty and the Beast is kind of like one of my huge ones. Because Hello Books, like, like that, that's not even a question. That's just that's just a statement. Uh, give me a second. I'll, I'll be in bed in a second. I gotta... I'm collecting some blocks. But I actually fall significantly less on the... Uh, Disney fandom than you would expect. Okay. All right. Because so... they're movies and I have to watch movies and I don't watch movies. Gotcha. So okay. I don't, even those I don't like beauty and beast is about the only one I'll sit still for everything else. I'm like, okay, just give me the soundtrack. I will go enjoy the soundtrack and fuck the rest of this. All right. <laughs> that's no, that's, that's fair. I just, I didn't know because you know I I I do I am I am somewhat familiar with your media consumption habits, so because like it's all it's all based on you know movie stuff, then it's kind of like okay well what's the what's the the sort of deal here you know? Yeah, so I like Beauty and the Beast. I I at least recognize Disney references, so it's not like. If you took me to, like, I don't know, say there was, like, a movie Hall of Fame, I would just be like, I don't, all of this is Greek to me. Like, I at least had a childhood that, you know, included most of the staples. Sure. So I at least, like, know most of them. But I, I, we were actually planning, like, this, this year, we were supposed to go to Disney. We were gonna, we never had a real honeymoon. So we were going to do our five-year anniversary at Disney. I heard. Yeah, I Lollipop started, told like, planning me. out what we are going to do. So this year we were supposed to go to Disney. Because I've never been. He had gone on a Disney cruise, but he'd been really sick at the time. Or just getting back from being really sick <laughs> at the time. So he wasn't allowed to do anything. Yeah, that was a story in itself. Almost died because, uh, yeah, food poisoning and shit. Not oh, E. coli. E. coli. I had E. coli. Oh, ooh, um, it, it almost made me a dead lollipop. So Ooh. they wouldn't let him like scuba dive or anything because they were keeping extra eye on like all his vitals to make sure he did not dead. Like the ship's doctors like knew me by name because of the fact that I had like just gotten out of the hospital like two or three days before we went on this on this boat. Okay. Like, they actually knew who I was, and I only had a limited number of things I was allowed to do. So, like... So um, we had never been on a Disney cruise, and we were gonna go to Disney, because I've never been, and I at least wanted to go and see, like, what I thought of it, because it's, it's, it's gonna go one of two ways. I'm either gonna absolutely adore it, and we're gonna end up with passes, or I'm not gonna find it worth the trouble for travel, because I don't like change, and I like my home, and I like my homebody. Mm-hmm. And I'm, it's, I'm gonna see what the appeal is for other people, but I'm just, it's not gonna be my thing. There's, there's like no in between. Right. No, that's 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 understandable, and like, yeah, I can I can see how it can kind of go in both directions. You know, like Ali says, she, you know, her her fandom has waned over the years, and it, I can see that, and it, it has not waned in this household. Um. We actually we had passes and we canceled them. Um, Disney like the the parks gave an option or Disney World gave an option. Um, not too long into the pandemic to be able to cancel your passes, uh, your annual passes at no penalty, um, just because of everything going on. So we elected to do that because, again, there, there was no point in paying for a thing that we weren't going to use. Especially when that thing is fucking $50 a month per person. Uh -huh. um, and, I mean, when we were going, we yes. were going. So, like, it was worth it for us to go 
you know, in the before times, but after the pandemic started, there really was no point. Um, and we were really disappointed. Like Sabrina was heartbroken over it. And I, I like, I hate it for her, but you know, again, I mean, there's, there's no point in us doing something that we can't do or paying for something we can't do. Right. So um, yeah, that's, that is where I stand is that I, I am probably going to have to go to see how I feel. Yeah. That, that makes a lot of sense. And that's, that's you know for for the two of us like we had already like we we had both just separately had gone to disney in the past so you know we knew it was a thing that we would enjoy doing it was at the time a matter of kind of justifying the cost so we started off with like the some of like the lower tier passes um that had like a bunch of blackout dates on them um so I got those for her birthday um, one year, several years ago, just so we could try it out and see how it went. Bless you. Um, and we really liked it. And again, it was just about a matter at the time of being like, okay, is this something that, you know, we want to continue doing, we want to continue paying for, which it was. So we liked it, but, you know, we'll, we're just kind of now waiting to see once it's kind of safe to go again, which we know we're still several months out from that, so yeah, I don't, I don't know. Honestly, it's probably I'm probably not going to jump this year or maybe even next year to go. I'm probably going to wait and see how things really blow over because I've heard, unfortunately, I've heard less than great things on some of their employee safety so yeah it's that's and that's the thing like the the actual patron safety they've been really good about and, but the employees that's been a lot more concerning yeah like i i haven't heard anything oh what the hell i mean although patrons could be affected by some of but like just i've heard a lot of misinformation and kind of forced stuff with employees that really disappointed me especially earlier on like at this point there are some things that i could like not be as disappointed in but this was like i was hearing these things like early on so i'm just like eh. yeah i don't know i it's kind of one of those things i gotta decide later how mad i am about it and i know what you mean I probably talk to a couple of my friends who are who have worked for there and if they get to go back how it really is um, like once I'm even thinking about it because that's just like, uh, it's just been unsettling. Yeah. Like we had a couple different plans cause like my best friend in Ohio has never been. So she was like po planning to either possibly if she could have swung it, like be there the same time we went for our five year and like meet up for dinner once or twice, but otherwise like not really hang out. Yeah. Um, and bring one of her significant others. Um and but and so she was still like she recently reached out to me and she was like I'm still considering this like, you know, post pandemic and I'm like I don't know if I am because I've got to talk to some people and see like really how did they handle this. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. So, it's just a mess. It is a mess, yeah. Allie, if you, like, the next time y'all come down here, like, you know, again, post-pandemic, if, if, if you would like to go, and we're kind of back on, you know, on going, if you would like to go, we would, we would be happy to take you, and I know that is absolutely not Tom's thing, so, you know, Tom, I, if you wanted to hang back and not do that, you know, we would be more than happy to take Allie and... And, you know, you can have some some quiet time or go spend some extra time with the nieces or something. Well, yeah, I got a great day of quiet time with Senior. <laughs> well, I mean, what would you rather do? Spend the day with Senior or spend the day at Disney? Oh, 
Yeah. <laughs> so expensive. <laughs> it's like, I think I'll go. So, like, unnecessarily expensive. I mean, we would I we would take care of it. I mean, it's not that big of a deal for us. It's no, like, I mean, that's that was like everything. No, I know, I know. So for, the other part of that is the time she has off now is during the summer, and ain't nobody going to Disney in the middle of the summer. Listen here, I my so I told y'all I moved here at the end of June in two thousand eight. That first weekend of July was 4th of July weekend, and boy howdy, I was at Disney that weekend and never fucking again. Although, it was pretty funny. Um, at one point, we were in line for, um, the, the group I was with, we were in line for Peter Pan, and um, like I did the entire Monty Python sca- spam sketch um, all by myself. Um, voices and all, so that was fun, and everybody in line got a kick out of that. And then they had the the parade through like Frontierland, and after the parade, like people were all kind of bunched up together, trying, making making terrible attempts at moving out of the way. So I made very loud cattle noises, and it was like parting the Red fucking Sea. Let me tell you, people got the fuck out of the way when they thought there was a giant fucking cow behind them. Turns out it was only if we a bear. Do decide to go, we will we will hit up you and Sabrina for advice. Absolutely, yeah. Like, and so, if you know, because I, I was trying to do my research, but there's like 18 million people who all have their opinions on Disney, and I'm just like, I just, uh, I am not a Disney. Like, it's a thing, and I'm like, okay, I don't need the whole like thing. I need to go visit. I just need to do research. Stop it. Yeah, like, and we can, like, we'll, we know all of the things to do there. Like, we've been, you know, we were pass holders for several years. We, we, we went, we did, like, you know, we've done big stuff. We've done casual shit. Like, we've, we've done, we've done it all. So, you know, if you, if there's anything that y'all want to know about, please let us know. We, we can tell you. When I get to that point again, I will hit you up for information. Okay. But for now, I am completely scrapping it because I don't want to plan a thing that I can't plan, which is the end of this damn pandemic. Uh, yeah, Ali, Ali, uh, Epcot is more is absolutely like the adult park. Like that's that's where that's where you go. Now that that I think, Tom, you would actually enjoy because drinking and potatoes around the world. I, I was going to say, I've been told, because we were going to do, what we were going to do was, uh, like, five parks over the course of a week kind of thing, so that we could spend a day in each park. Wait, f- and, what would um, be the fifth, like, one of the water parks? Yeah. Oh, okay. It, it's counted as a park. Okay, fair. Um, <laughs> There's you... two water parks, in fact. We had, to, we had to decide between which water park we were we were going to. We had gotten that far. We had picked out which which five parks we wanted to go see. Uh, you... I think, um, yeah, because the because I think right right around when we I started working at Suncoast, that's one of the things I uh I asked you was if you had an opinion on which water park was better. Yeah, yeah, we did. I think we you have... gave it to me. I just don't remember what it was now. Yeah, well, so here's, and what's funny about that is like. The answer, I mean, the answer is the same now because, you know, I, we haven't really been back. Um, but it kind of depends. Like Sabrina had always gone to Blizzard Beach. I had gone to Typhoon Lagoon and we both liked them. We both liked our respective ones, but we, you know, we've both been to each other's water parks now. And we both like the other's water parks, too. But uh, the Lazy River at... Um, the Lazy River at Typhoon Lagoon is is most good. And let me tell you, I'm all about a fucking we Lazy were, River. Yes, because I, I was like, I want to spend the water park day on the Lazy River. Yep. <laughs> so, but yeah, we, we were going to do that, and... My coworker was just like, 
talking about Epcot and all the food, and I was I was so looking forward to that. Food, yeah, I I've I've always liked Epcot a lot, and Sabrina Sabrina like she likes Magic Kingdom a lot more, but you know she's she's more of like the classic Disney fan. Um, you know she's a lot more into like uh, a lot of the princess stuff, um, Haunted Mansions there, which Haunted Mansion is always a is always a good time. Plus, it's inside and heavily air conditioned and goddamn near pitch black yeah yeah you get to sit in a doom buggy and in in the air conditioning in the dark it's great i love it great (laughs) we were trying to to plan their food late april to like miss some of the heat like the worst of the heat because we can't do our actual anniversary because my work would kill me if i tried to take a week off during peak season I, I, oh I, yeah, I, yeah no, yeah no. They're, they're, <laughs> tax season. I want to go take a, a honeymoon. Like I probably could, but they would probably want to murder me. But yeah, Epcot food. I was like super food. looking forward to. Yeah, the Epcot food is food's really good there, especially during Food and Wine, where they have like a big sampling in like every country. And then like a bunch of stuff, and 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 they have a fucking they have an ocean spray cranberry bog. Of course they do. Yeah, you're goddamn and right they course, do. Of course, that's what you are most excited for. You're goddamn right I am. But yeah, yeah I, I didn't have a. I, I still don't. I, I'm with you, Allie. I don't didn't have a burning desire to go, but it was just kind of one of those like I haven't done this, and now I have a much easier than from Ohio opportunity to do this. I feel like I should consider it. Just so peopley. It is very peopley. I know, Tom, and that's like that's your kryptonite. That's my concern. Is I uh, that is my main concern between heat and people i am worried that i'm going to hate it i don't want to hate it but i am concerned the the worst the the people really aren't terrible um the thing that you have to worry about most are um people with incredibly young children like um, babies toddlers and you have to worry about them because of the fucking strollers now they've gotten a lot better about the strollers because they've imposed a lot of restrictions on them now because it has been such a problem. But like people pushing strollers, they'll just run you the fuck over and not not even look back at you. Like they will they will just run you right the fuck over. And let me tell you, I've almost I've almost pummeled a couple That's of guys. Your stroller tipped over. Huh? <laughs> That's a good way to get your stroller tipped over. That's a good way to get a stroller shoved up your ass is what it is. I was particularly (laughs) worried about that. That just. This sounds like uh, some some small children are about to get a a Virtue Town retirement package. Yeah, I don't give a fuck about your kids. Don't hit me with your stroller. Uh, No, it's 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 not even the kids like it's the parents. So it's like maybe maybe you get to explain why daddy has a black eye and the stroller's front wheel is bent. But, you know, it's fine. That was not the problem I was expecting, honestly. I just don't want people to talk to me all the time. People, they That's don't. They don't. Like, people... Good. People are there. They are there with their own agenda, with their own shit they want to do. They don't. And Go honestly, ahead. it's it's one of the, the times where people being like selfish twats is actually it's a good thing because they're so absorbed in their own shit. And I mean, you know, it's a lot of people who haven't been there before, so they're just kind of taking it all in and, and enjoying themselves and whatever. Um, I was gonna say. I mean, you spend the bajillion grand you need to spend to get there from anywhere else. And yeah, it would be a bit self-absorbed too. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah, it's, it's, it's not just that. Like it's, you know, and I'm not saying I'm, I'm certainly not saying everybody that goes is like that. Um, but it is one of those things where people are just like, you know, they're just, they're just doing their thing, man. And they're having a good time and they're just focused on what they're doing. 
So it's yeah, people people do not talk to you very often. Even me, Good. even me who apparently can't meet a fucking stranger. Also, magnetic, it has a magnetic like attraction to people who want to discuss anything and everything. Oh, don't say it like that. Now you just make it sound gross. Am I wrong though? I did what I said. You heard what I said. I said what I said. <laughs> I'm in this gross statement and I don't like it. <laughs> right. Like, I don't know what else to tell you. Like I usually just slink away. We did go to Universal for Christmas one year cuz uh his our sister-in-law got free tickets through her work. And that was neat. But oh boy howdy, before I go anywhere, do I need to find shoes that I can actually walk in and not like cry? Elena literally, literally looking over at Lollipop and going, "Let's get some shoes." Like, we, they were, she has a pair now. Now and so far, they're working pretty well. But uh, like, I think my sister-in-law and like brother-in-law thought I was just like didn't want to go anywhere. And when we got home, Chris, like I finally got my shoes and socks off, and Chris is like. What the heck happened to your feet? I'm like, I told you I was in pain. Oh, yeah. I wasn't just, like, saying that. Like, my feet were... Well, and it was both parks in the same day. So my oh, feet yeah. were just, like, twice their size. Yeah, yeah. Well, like, and that's... Shoes are no. for people that leave their house. <laughs> Tom's like, shoes? I haven't heard that name in years. Um... Yeah, we, I mean, that's, that's also part of the reason what, that we justified doing the Disney passes is like, we could either, we could go either go to a gym and do things that we hate and then eventually stop going to the gym and, you know, waste the time and the money on that. Or we can get Disney passes and do stuff that we actually enjoy doing and also, you know, get five, like bazillion steps in a single day and do it that way can confirm would be more motivated to walk for Disney than I would be for anything else. Yeah. At least once and till I decided if I liked it or not. Right. The 2 hour drive is really I think like if it was closer, I think I would be sold on it just no matter what. Yeah, I understand. Like, like yeah. it's it's the drive the drive can be a little daunting but like we I mean again the first couple of times you're like, eh. after that though, it's you, you you get used to it, and it's just kind of like it's like, oh, we're driving to Disney today. All right. We got spoiled a bit when like, when we first got down here, or drive like anywhere we needed to go, like except for IKEA to pick up furniture. Like we we're just starting out. We were like. Everything was really close by. It's, it's just twenty minutes. Just like for everything that we needed to do. Yeah, it's just twenty just minutes. Just twenty right. minutes, yeah. yeah. And and like even worse, like Walmart was literally right up the street. Yeah. Because we were on um Coachman. Northeast Coachman. Oh yeah. So there was a Walmart yep. literally like right across the street from where we lived. Oh and yeah. And so that was never an issue. And then like any anytime we had to drive like 45 minutes we're like eh, do we really want do we really need to do this like yeah <laughs> coming we're, from ohio where we were commuting 40 minutes just to get to each other's place at the start of our relationship down here it seemed it like the, the it's just 20 minutes so it's just like magic yeah the, i will say that is one of the nice things about this area that we live in especially is that like we're we are really close to a lot of stuff. Like there's a lot of it's it's the 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 stuff that we need is fairly densely packed in. I mean, like I can I can I can spit on the Walmart that we live across the street from. And you should. And I should, you're right. Oh boy.
Because, like, we had... It was mostly Walmart and... Um, Sheets. Sheets? Oh, I thought Which... you were talking about back in Ohio. No, in Ohio, everything was strewn out everywhere. Like, there was... Especially, like, if we wanted to go... Like, even once you moved in with me, like... All of your friends were still like 45 minutes away so anytime we did anything that involved any of your friends we were still like had to do a drive i was so glad when i was done on that commute that was the worst commute i bet Look, did you know that there was a wienermobile pop i did know that there was a wienermobile pop yeah yeah i and i thought seriously about getting it but like i don't collect the pops and i don't really have a place to put them even if i started like I've got, I've got three. I th well, no, I've got six because I got two that somebody gave me. Andrea gave me a couple because she had like leftovers from some event that she worked one time when I was staying with her in Seattle. And then, um, uh, you remember Tim that used to work with us at Lab Tech, right? With that always wore the hat and had the bum knee and mm -hmm. stuff. Tim gave me, um, he he actually got, because they were on like on sale or on clearance or something, uh, he got me both a Charlie Brown and Linus um, pops. So I have them up on the shelf, and then I got a Doc Brown one up there that I think he also found. Um, and that's about it. Like, that's that's the extent of my pops. Um, but I have seen the Wienermobile one, and it's gorgeous. Like, it's... I mean, all the pops are just like the detail on them is is impeccable. Um, but like, it's the Wienermobile. I want to drive the fucking Wienermobile so bad. I just, I just want to bring happiness and hot dogs to people. Is that so? Is that such a bad dream to have? There's a spam just, can. Oh, I didn't know there's a I spam just can. Came a, it's holding the key. I just. I just came across a recipe that I feel like Zach would be interested in, which is the Cadbury's cream scotch egg. Cream oh. egg surrounded by chocolate cake, dipped in chocolate, and rolled in flake. I've oh, seen I've seen the Cadbury <laughs> scotch egg. I have seen I have seen the top of the mountain. Because I I really thought they were gonna wrap it in sausage. I, I would I would also eat a Cadbury cream egg wrapped in sausage <laughs> and 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 and, ra and rolled in breadcrumbs and fucking fried. You know I would. I know, I know. You're goddamn right. I will. It is just... the season is upon us, folks. Cadbury cream eggs for all. I was just scrolling my Facebook and saw that, and I was like, Zach needs to know this exists, and he does not already know this exists. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. Um, someone in our house really likes those, and someone in our house does not. Well, I'm sorry that you were wrong, but at least you married a woman who was right. I don't... I mean, Tom... Oh, my God, the Hamburglar. Tom, I'm going to have to... <laughs> this is a rarity for me to say this, but I agree with you, Tom. Ah, I knew it would happen eventually. <laughs> One day. I'm not, but mine, mine is solely a texture thing. I am not much of a cream-filled anything because cream just, it just, it's weird and combination-y to me. Yeah. So you can giggle like a child. <laughs> giggle too Whatever. much and I'll just continue the trend of not liking cream-filled things. Damn. Get fucking wrecked, lollipop. <laughs> 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 uh, Precedent dang. is already set. Awkward. <laughs> awkward. Awkward turtle. Where's the awkward turtle? <laughs> awkward turtle. Uh, yeah, cream eggs, man. I'm about that life. Who boy am I about that life? Oh, I know. Oh, uh, no it. Um, you can have my share of the Cadbury cream eggs. All right. In the world. Me, me and my buddy Greg, who lives up in Seattle, he's he's about that life, too. And, man, um, we saw a thing last year during the season where somebody had taken, like, a shit ton of, of Cadbury cream eggs. Like, a chef had taken a shit ton of them and, like, like gotten all the cream out of them and then melted the chocolate together and made one massive cream egg. 
And oh boy, oh boy, let me tell you, I would, I would chow down on like the massive cream egg. That'd be like if someone took like an entire sack of potatoes and somehow Frankensteined them together to make one gargantuan baked potato. That's, that's like, that's like Tom Super Bowl right there. The spud I mean, to end all spuds. I, I, we've got some places that have already done that. Oh, I know you do, bud. McAllister's, Jason's. Oh, Jason's. We, I, I don't think we've still been back to McAllister since the day that Sabrina wasn't feeling well, and we're 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 pretty certain that it wasn't. Like, I think she got she got the mushroom soup, and it was like really rich, and I think that just kind of set her off. Just made her not feel the great. Yeah, but in the end, it doesn't really matter if that caused it or not. If it's the last thing you remember in eating, it sticks with you a while. Yeah, exactly. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I've, I've, I've stopped eating worse things for less reasons. So. That's true. But my sister refused to eat Wendy's for years. She was convinced she got food poisoning. I can't imagine a world in which Lollipop does not eat Wendy's. I had Wendy's earlier today. See, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, this has been good, but it's gotten me hooked on the sugar cookies. We are at time, folks. Look at this, though. We uh, like I have hollowed the fuck out of this this bad boy. Like, oh my god. You are putting it in work. I am just digging a hole i mean you're Hopefully putting lollipop in lollipop brings back some more so it looks like i did something diggy, diggy hole, diggy, diggy hole. i mean i'm just digging a hole too but you know i'm i'm digging a hole out of a structure as opposed to like you know out of the world i still got like another layer up here to go but and i, I mean i haven't even finished the, this one but on the second floor huh nice I got a lot done on the second floor. Nice. Yeah, we got to come see that. We got to come see that. Um, most, of the, most of the structure bits are in now. Nice. So, almost there. Almost there. And then I so, do it two more times. I was going to say, so soon we have Terracotta? Yeah, Terracotta's next. Nice. Unless you think the fishermen need to be next. Nah, get the Terracotta. I don't know. We, we, we do have a lot of fish. That'll... I will say that'll get us a lot of fucking emeralds, some some cash monies. Um, well, thank y'all for hanging out tonight. We we had a we had a good night tonight. Uh, I wonder if anybody else is streaming. Let's see. Let's see if anybody else is awake at this ungodly hour. Most of our people are in the U.S., so they're not streaming still. Oh, I know. How raid us on your mom? Wouldn't be the first if I raided your mom. Oh! We just call her Paula. <laughs> yeah, nobody's nobody's streaming. <laughs> All right, I think we're good though. Um, oh, I gotta see if the I don't think the the emote has been approved yet. I'm still waiting on that. Ah, God. God, I wonder how long it's going to take, because, like, I put that in yesterday early afternoon. So, we'll see how that goes. 69 days. Nice. Um, so, yeah. Uh, we'll be back on Sunday. Um, I think Sunday I will, now that I've got, like, all the outside of this done, um, and I've been spending a lot of time, like, cleaning up the inside... I think I'll probably have the inside finished hollowing out um, by uh, the end of next stream. So Sunday night we'll finish this up. Um, and then we'll take a visit over to Trader Tom's to see the progress of the second floor. Uh, which sounds like you got a lot right going. Now it's like the incomplete second Death Star. That's the incomplete second Death Star. So like there's like panels open and shit and like an entire side of it's just like wires. That's fair. Um, and then uh, 
Lollipop will have more map filled out, and so that'll be cool. You'll probably have that that it's one map done. finished, won't you, huh? It's almost done, yeah. Nice. Like Eighty-nine percent of the way there. Nice. I dig it. I dig it. Um, all right. So, hey, don't forget. There's merch. There is. There is merch. Kidarino. Go. Justice for Kidarino. Hashtag Justice for Kidarino. Yes. Go buy a Kidarino T-shirt or a mug or a hoodie. There's hoodies. Um, and join the Discord because we have. The emotes, the emotes are actually already live in the Discord because I can control that. Um, and let's see what else. That's pretty much it until Sunday. So back on Sunday, 7.30 Eastern as always. And until then, y'all have a very good night and a very safe weekend. See you later. <laughs>